Hello everyone, how are you doing? Welcome to Game Tech UK, welcome to Thursday evening, um, and as it says in the description, join me for a cosy night of Train Sim World 4. I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to play, I've got a couple of new lines to play, I know we've got the Fife um, uh, Circle Line, London Overground as well, I want to see the Suffragette Station, but yeah, just play for a nice few hours, nice and chilled, you can already tell. By the way, I'm talking a little bit quieter. I'm in a proper chilled mood. I've got a nice cup of tea. We might move on to the whiskey later. I don't know. Maybe. But yes, um, how is everyone? What what you all been doing? I've been at work all day. <laughs> Made me laugh. My missus brought me lunch up. And uh, she come up. I'm going to work about nine. She come up about one. And she went, how's it been? And I took my PlayStation portal. I went, it's been really busy. I've barely had time to play the PlayStation. <laughs> <laughs> I meant it as well. <laughs> right, let me say some lovely hellos. Yeah, we're we're early, but it shows that I want to be here, doesn't it? I want to get as many hours in um, as I can because I'm not stre I'm not streaming um, all of next week. So this will be the last stream for about a week. Um, it's always half term. It's not always half term. I always go away or do something with the family in half term. So the f the half term is two weeks. For the first week, I'm not a around at all. Second week, I'll be on and off and then back to normal after that. But yes, so I thought we'd come on uh, nice and early. Who we got in? We got Seth, Melody, Joseph. Hello, Mark, Kyle. Uh, Kyle's come in to um, <laughs> to see the uh, the corpses again, haven't you, Kyle? <laughs> <laughs> hello dangerous we got can man hello daniel christopher davidson how are you one of your favorites thank you stevie thank you mate hello gear how are you i've been in sweden driving around the small city today a lot of strange cars and people is that exclusive to sweden because that sounds very similar to driving around here hello alan h how are you we've got yuval how are you my da boom we've got george david gord yeah we've got loads of people hello joseph yeah, thank you for coming in. Hopefully you've left me a little cheeky like. Uh, maybe even a little share. How, what are you thinking of it, uh, Baza? The seven-year-old follows me everywhere. Saw this stream was coming ten hours ago. He said he heard the music and told me straight away. What's his name, Roderick? Is he there now? We can say hello to him. Hello, Lola. How are you? Yeah, Rinsport. I haven't played. I only did a couple of streams once I got the code. I haven't touched it since. I really need to get back to it with the new equipment, though. Hello, Christopher. <laughs> Who follows me everywhere. That's lovely, though, isn't it? Who, who wouldn't want that? A good bridge review. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hello, Simon. Will you be coming back to the farm soon? Yeah, absolutely. I'm still paying for it. It's still there. Nothing's happened. Mark's cleaned it all up because apparently all you little gits left it in a right state. So Mark has um, gone in there and jet washed everything, put everything back to where it should be. It doesn't matter if it sits there for another three months. Who cares? I paid for it. It's there. It's not going anywhere. We'll pick it back up. It's not a problem. Yeah, yeah. Hurry up a bit, please. Oh, Seth, Seth, Seth. Seriously. It's been too long for a bridge review. Yeah, I need to get back into the farm. Yeah. You know what it's like. Once I get back on there, people will get interested again. And I just need to work out. Um, yes, yeah, so that won't be until after the, the Easter and half term. Let me put that up to all chat. Uh, Romeo. Yeah, Romeo, and he sat next to you. Hello, Romeo. How are you, mate? How are you? High five. Let's do this, right? Don't touch the screen because Roderick won't like that. But let's, let's high five. Come on. Put your hand up. That's it. Oh, bosh. We've done it. <laughs> He's probably left by now. He's like, no, I'm not doing that. <laughs> nice one. Right, let's have a look. Let's, let's get on with it. Let's, let's see um, what we're going to... Be actually playing should we see the five circle line he's waving loving it <laughs> hello british ace how are you which one should i do first the under london overground uh, which one is the um uh the um goblin what's it called which one's that because i've got a few new haven't I? i've got this one i've got that it's got snow in it so that's attracting me and i've got the five circle line london overground and um uh, the miltonburg London Overground, yeah, yeah. All right, let's do that. So scenarios, football focus. Transport for London have put on a football tour service for football fans. Take a tour of the London football team stadium, learning a little along the way. Oh, London Overground is goblin. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, let's do that then. Let's do that, 45 minutes. I'm going to take it nice and slow because you don't want me making mistakes, do you? <laughs> 
<coughs> Hello, Vexy. How are you? How are you? Yeah, hopefully you've left me a little um, cheeky like. Any idea when City Skylines 2 is coming to console? No, no. No, it, I mean, they, they cancelled it. Not, not cancelled it, but it was coming out at the same time. And then they just went, no, we're not doing it. We've got some more work to do. And they haven't been around since. I'll tell you what is good, which I've been playing on the PlayStation Portal, is Planet Zoo uh, Console Edition. Really good. Very menu heavy, though. That's the only thing I would say. Very menu heavy. But other than that, yeah, it was. Uh, I've enjoyed uh, playing it for a few hours. Also doing a working at heights course at the same time. Thank God for GT UK. Well, don't be careful, all right? Just be careful. I'm I'm stuck here. Look, what the? No one worked that out, did they? So if you open it like that, well, that's a good start. Oh, come on, that must have been picked up, surely. I only went up to it like this. Look, innocently. Yeah, okay. I'll put that on the list for him, shall I? <laughs> it's very good, yeah, yeah. Looks like a nice train. Oh, God, look, oh, look at the flowers and all that. Is it, this is, oh, God, here we go. Oh, I should play this more. This is lovely. <laughs> I like not playing this very often. I am a Dovetail ambassador. Not much of an ambassador. Oh, I don't really play it. But when I do, I do love the game. I really do, yeah. Oh, you drove these for two years. Oh, nice. Where's the fat controller? I'm here, Dave. Dave. <laughs> Hello, Beard. How are you? <coughs> right. Okay. Let's uh, let's put it in, and the master key to uh, forward. We have got the expert in the chat, British Ace. I'm sure most of you know him anyway. But if you're looking for more professional train sim streams, that's your place to go. Press the AC button, uh, AC select system. Cool. Press the panties up button. <laughs> I can say I'm not much of an ambassador, have I? Pantograph. Sorry, I misread it. I misread it. Next up is Leighton Midland Road for connections to both West Ham United and Leighton or oh it's gone Leighton Orient. It does look lovely, doesn't it? It's a really good game beard, yeah. I'm 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 almost completing it, so then I can do the season pass stuff. It's just getting back on it to do it. What happens if you press the panties down? David, you're on a bloody course. Just concentrate, all right? <clears throat> oh, it's such an accomplished game, though, isn't it? Look at it, look. Absolutely brilliant. Cool. Right, does that all look and sound all right? It's nice and smooth, you're all happy. Oh, you keep getting booted where it's it's out to it's like it's almost like a new release today, isn't it? Everyone's gonna be on it for Game Pass. Hello Mort, how are you? Right, so this um we've got a green light. Let, let's let's stay um turn on say uh, let's stay concentrating today so I don't make loads of mistakes. <laughs> All good, yeah, cool. All right, we're below the speed limit, so we can just ramp it up a little bit. So we've got um, two... I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Because I'm covering it up. All right, so I'm just going to move me down to about there. Let me know if that's better because um, we've got all that. So let me have a look. Oh. 
Yeah, that should be about right. What do you think? Actually, a little bit more, if anything. Yeah, a little bit more. So you can see... Um, that's it about there. Because you want to see that as well, don't you? Because then you can warn me when things are going to go wrong. <laughs> right, okay. Oh, we've got a nice bit of lean on going there. Look at that. Look at the lean. Oh, yes. Yeah, graphics look lovely, didn't they? They're very much improved, on, especially on these new routes as well. So Train Sim 4 improved, and in new routes, even more improved. And we're just going to coast. So we're going, we go via the location. That means we haven't got to stop. Hello, Mickey, how are you? Yeah, that means we haven't got to stop, so we're all right. Yeah, let's have it there about that. Is that alright with my webcam there? At least you can see what's going on as well. It is beard, yeah. It is. Right, we're going via location, alright? Hello, PJ. Yeah, I'm all right. There we go. Yeah, they got slam door trains in this. Yeah, yeah, of course. And and, and with the scenario, oh shit, with with the scenario planner, you can. Uh, <laughs> funnily enough, I was thinking about this earlier. I've never done it. Never, never fiddled with it at all. But you can take any train to any route. Am I right in saying that, British Ace? You can do that, can't you? So if I wanted to take my Class 37 with a load of slam door carriages on this route, maybe not this route, because it's a... Maybe this route. Maybe any route. Yeah, but you can chop and change, yeah. Yeah, exactly, Baz. I mean, it's not 100% my... my game but once you get on here I mean who's not gonna enjoy who's not gonna enjoy that you know the frames are a little bit choppy that's the only problem uh, I did try running this in 4k uh, I might um, put it back down to 2k and then I can put everything up yeah ultra let's try that I want it to be smooth for you. Yeah, that's better. That's smoother. I doubt if that makes any difference to your viewing, does it? But it is um, It is smoother now. That's better. Yeah. Yeah, let me know. Do you prefer that or as it was before? Right, we're going via the location as well. I don't think this has got DLSS, actually. Let me have a look. Sorry to um, mess about. Advanced. Yeah, there is no DLSS. And it, it's it's quite a system hungry game, uh, especially on Ultra, obviously. Um, ye it blurrier is it a little bit blurrier? Uh, what I could do is actually because it was on Ultra. Let, let's put it to um, let's go back to 4K and put it on medium. So we still get the resolution. Oh god, that looks fucking terrible. That's no good. <laughs> yeah, not having that. Not having that at all. <laughs> Let, let's go high. Oh god, we're, we're, we're playing settings um, simulator now, aren't we? Right, that might be alright. Uh, we've got a solid 60, right? Yeah, that'll do, won't it? Oh, look how, look how much smoother it is as well. Yeah, that's fine. Right, let's concentrate on that. You're trying to find the GoPro which you put on your logo. Oh god, yeah, I've done that before. I'm proper getting itchings about going up on my model railway again. I think it's coming. 
The frame cap was 60, yeah, I can't do any more than 60 anyway, because I don't want to, I've only got a 60 monitor, and I can only stream um, <laughs> back to default settings after about three hours, yeah. <laughs> nah, that's fine for me, yeah, and it, it's smooth, look, it's smooth, that's the most important thing for a stream. Yeah. I mean, we could maybe just try and turn a few things up. <laughs> Wait, I said this was a cosy evening with me, all right? Just, just chill out, all right? Um, yeah, let's put... Um, texture quality up. Put the sky, sky quality up, of course. Uh, effects on high, and let's try that. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. Yeah, let's try that. Quality wise, oh okay, yeah. And we're still on sixty. Yeah, totally fine. We'll leave it on that, right? I'm not gonna touch any more settings for the rest the, for the rest of the night, alright? Let's let's enjoy um the actual train. Right, we're going too fast. Right, we're going via this location. We have got a yellow, so I think that'll be a red next, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, this is cool. Cool, I feel like I'm sitting right down in the cab. I feel like I want to be up there more. Cool, yeah, I'm right up for this tonight. It won't be choppy now, Chief, because it's... um. 60 frames can't be choppy it won't be choppy what you stream on 1440 yeah and play in 4k yeah yeah so i want the best quality for you so if you go up to 1440 or 2k but i also want to give that 2k the best chance by putting in the best before we use the down sampler um i want to put the best quality i i can um so you end up with a really nice stream hopefully harsh breaking You have a um, elite stream. What does that mean? Yeah, hopefully it should vexy. I'm I'm pleased with the quality of my streams. It should be pretty sweet. Hello, Pete. How are you? Oh God, I spent ages trying to get it nice, and I, I think the majority of my streams are pretty good. <laughs> I don't mean the streams. I mean the quality. The quality is easy to get right. An entertaining stream is a bit harder. <laughs> Oh, you're having a later stream? Oh, I think I'll probably play this, to be honest with you. Yeah. Oh, stop at location. Okay. Now, I think the brakes felt like they were really good on this. Really good. That must be your end, Mickey. Oh, not emergency. No, you don't need to go into emergency. Would you ever max out a system with components just to have the best level or highest level quality? Um, well, each time I've got a PC, there's pretty much the, the top end, and then things move on. Yeah, things just move on very, very quickly. Yeah, I probably would. Yeah, yeah, of course. No, th no that's the right. No, no. <laughs> Don't do that. There we go. That's better. Oh, is it beard? Okay, okay. Oh, you are Rod's grandson. Hello, Romeo. How are you, mate? That's good. How are you, mate? Pete, thank you very much. Oh, I hope Romeo gets it. Tracy got it. She's lovely. How are you, Tracy? Hello, Tace. How are you? Oh, you slipped in there? Or was you already... Yeah, you was already in, wasn't you? How are you? Right, locked doors. Bosh, here we go. Yeah, welcome, Romeo. And everyone, please say welcome to Romeo. That's Roderick, who's a lovely geezer. Um, that's his grandson. Glad you're on and playing this. You had a rubbish day, oh, did you, Christopher? Well, it, it can only get better then, can't it, really? It can only literally get better. Just two and a bit hours and uh, trains in real life. Oh, okay. What, you're going to work, are you? Yeah, Roderick is a, a very nice man, isn't he? Always friendly, always welcoming. I'll tell you what we will do. Bosh! Let's play a bit of this. Uh, da, 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 where is my... Photo mode. Oh, yeah. Let's get some, let's get some photo mode going.
That's cool. Uh, debt fulfilled. That's it. We want that. Oh, yeah. We want the, the palettes at the front a little bit blurry. I like it. Yeah. Oh, I like that as well. Look, we've even got the... the oh, that's a really good picture. Yeah, I'm having that. Uh, yeah, I like that. Save and upload. Bosh. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. Right. Yeah, the, the detail is fantastic. Yeah. And like... um. Like Baz has said, for those that enjoy this sort of thing, this is this, this is brilliant. Yeah, and there is a huge amount of detail, huge amount of detail. Right, we're just coasting. We're just below the. Oh, I'd love to live there, wouldn't you? That'd be welcome. I've always wanted to live next to a train track. Do you use any mods? No, no. No, it's straight out of the box. Right, that looks pretty good now, doesn't it? The, the quality-wise, I know the frame rate's fine, because look, 60 frames on the dot. So that's that's more than enough for me. Sometimes it's just a case of getting the graphics just right, and also some of the routes are more optimised than others, and like um, uh, um, British Ace says, this quality-wise... Well, did you say that? Did you say it's like Train Sim World 3, did you say? Because it looks pretty good to me. I love this section, look at that. <laughs> Stay on track. Don't derail this focus. No. Oh, go. Oh, that was lucky. That was more luck than anything. I'll tell you what we'll do. Should we save it? Should we save? <laughs> Just in case. Must stay concentrating. Oh, that's the five circle. Oh, okay. I was going to say, this looks pretty sweet. Oh, I'm sorry. I just want to take some more pictures. You're going to have to excuse me. Look at this review. Look at that. Uh, oh, uh... Let's have a look. Oh, that's a bit wrong, isn't it? Oh, I like this cutting, though. This cutting's fantastic. If Tace is in the chat, he'll appreciate this cutting from a model railway aspect. That's a beautiful cutting. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool. That really is cool, isn't it? Tace, are you still here? Uh, just ask him. What are you asking, uh, Vexy? Sorry. No, you're all right. Yeah, yeah. Oh, can you come off the track? <laughs> just asking. Yeah, you can come off the track. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that is a, a lovely little shot. Oh, hang on, no. Yeah, if um, if Tace is still here, he'll like that shot because that's got Model Railway written all over it, that has. I do, I made a cutting if you remember. Of course I remember. That's why I said it. Of course I remember. I'm not going to forget that, am I? I'm definitely getting yearnings for... Uh, me model railway again, Tace. I think it's because I finished Lego now. Now I'm starting to... Um, I'll finish my JPS. I'll start one of the other models. And then I think I'll... Uh, me father-in-law's getting back into model railways. So, yeah, that's going to help. Yeah, I can see me getting back up there now. Right, so we're going via a location as well. <laughs> too many stops and starts yeah that's how trains work but thank you for coming in just getting back on my model railway David I've got a beautiful layout sitting in my loft and ever since I started the channel seven years ago I've barely touched it barely and it's still up there and I did go up there probably about six months ago cleaned every inch of track got all the trains running and everything just worked perfectly i'm so lucky because normally imagine how many hot and cold summers and winters we've had over seven years right stop okay um usually you'd have buckled tracks scenery would all crack it's like it's been in a time warp so it's still there for me and uh yeah yeah i'm gonna get back on it Oh, did you, David? Oh, nice. Yeah, it all looks exactly the same. Literally exactly the same. And I've got so much stuff up there. I don't even need to buy anything. I've got all the stuff to just continue doing my scenery and stuff. I don't need any trains. I've got enough trains, certainly for now. Trains are a lot more expensive now than they weren't there. When do we have a summer? <laughs> I was never talking about eggs, David.
there's John. Oh well, mate, see you at the canteen or whatever it is. Us truck drivers, uh, train drivers have. <laughs> yeah, I know it's a red light. I know. Actually, we're going too fast. No, Mark was. Oh, David, now you're confusing me. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the poor old, uh, thanks Melody, the poor old train channel is pretty much dead at the moment, but it will be revived. Can you be a guard on New Train Sim? N not really, no, no. Don't you start, Joseph. Look at that, though. Look at that. It's so cool. It's like having a model railway in a game. That's the way I look at it. Class 56, nice. Well, we went down to um, uh, Hornby a little while ago, and my father-in-law, he used to have a railway. Then they moved. He used to um, be a landlord, and upstairs he'd have his railway. And um, he had ill health, so they moved out of the pub. He broke his railway up, and his railway come up in my, in my loft. He said, look, I'm not going to do it anymore. I might as well donate it, donate it to your railway. But they ended up moving and he's got a spare room. He's starting to get, hmm, should I do my railway? I'm like, well, all your stuff is still in the box because I haven't touched it. Maybe if I had been working on the railway, he might have lost it all. But I was like, look, it's still sitting in the box. Why don't you do it? So was, for his birthday, we took him down to Hornby, um, like their little uh, shop and like visitor centre. And he, he come away with a train. Tr he brought, a, he likes steam trains. He brought a steam train. Don't know what one it was. But the chip for it was 65 quid. I couldn't believe it. When I used to do Model Railway seven years ago, the chip was a 10, 15 quid. I bet that was um, lockdown that did that, wasn't it? 60 odd quid for a chip. What are you talking about? The locos weren't more than 100 pound each when I used to do it seven years ago. It's gone up incredible. Oh, hello. That tree looks lovely, doesn't it? Bloody hell. Just reminded of bananas, yeah. Back from where, David? Yeah, definitely GTA. That's in Germany, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I'd love to go and see that. We're not reading any of these facts, are we? Every shot I see gives me inspiration for like that, again, for Model Railway. Because I'm not really into the real railway. I've got no interest in this train. If it goes past me, it, uh, you know, in, in the real world, I, I, I don't really give it a second look. My interest in trains is from a modelling point of view. L that scene there, just to model that, is definitely achievable, interesting. It would be, there's so much interest just in that one scene from a Model Railway point of view. The tunnel, the lift, the stairs, the flowers, the stairs to the lower section. They're bustling with, with inspiration. And Tate will know what I'm talking about. Just from that one shot, so much inspiration there. Um, but as for the real railway, I'm not that fussed about the real railway. It's like when I play bus sim, I'm not a fan of buses. Buses don't really mean anything to me. Um, but I just like the, the sort of genre. I play this because it's like trucking and, and driving. I love that. I love the relaxation. But I do love looking at the scenery because it gives me inspiration. It really does. <laughs> I remember I used to get some chip chip for a pound. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I just watched his latest, latest video, Stevie. He's moving. He's, he's brought a new house and he's going to rip it all up again and start yet again. Oh, lovely, Mark. Yeah, I've seen them. Uh, they're massive, aren't they? Full-size cockpit. Right, we're going via the location. 30 quid. DCC is over a ton now. The Hornby one is a flashy Bluetooth decoder. Oh, right. yeah, I think so. Yeah, I think he did get a Bluetooth one. Yeah. Hello, DJ Ken. How are you, mate? But yeah, the model railways are such a great hobby. Oh, an amazing hobby. It's one of them hobbies, a bit like gaming, where you can take it with you. Like, like if you've got to go work or you go on a long drive, it's almost like you, you pack up your hobby 
There's not many hobbies that you can do this, but you just take your model railway with you in your mind. And you, I can sit for hours driving, working, thinking, oh yeah, I could put that there. And then by the time I come home or uh, get back to the model railway, like the thinking time that you've given it um, keeps you busy, keeps you happy, and then you know what to do once you get back on it. It's brilliant. Hello, Para, how are you? Easter weekend off till Tuesday. Nice. You got an app for it? Oh, nice. How are you, Pugwash? I see you brought a motorbike or something. <laughs> Let me know how you get on with that. Like two quid or something, wasn't it? Oh, that's good, Mark. I bet you... you uh, did you say your son? I bet you enjoyed that. Trucking or trains is your better go-to, might, might I ask? Um, oh, God. Uh, what, from a video game aspect or a real-life aspect? Two pounds and six P delivered. What? I bet it's the bollocks, and I'll go and try and order it, and it won't be there. <laughs> Hello, KGB. How are you? What, you didn't have to... What, it's just two pounds and six P delivered. Uh, wow, that's more than a stamp, isn't it? Right, we're still going via the location. It's going to coast a little bit. Yeah, I know. I'm I'm staying on the. Uh, I'm staying on it. That's good, KGB. Yeah, we got a red coming up, but th this this actually um, this stops like a bloody car. It really does. I don't think we'd be panicking on this route because the brakes are so good. Is this a paid one? No, this is paid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to get my bike out soon. Another, another bloody hobby to try and fit in. <laughs> are you sure you didn't buy a picture of it? Oh, lovely, Mark. That's good, yeah. Technical experts, famous motorcycle, model building, block stimulation, locomotive bricks. <laughs> it's sort of exciting in a way, isn't it? Don't worry, I'm paying attention tonight. All right. <laughs> nine already it's not nine o'clock is it do you mean nine o'clock because it's only eight o'clock mate what kind of bike in push bike no a motorbike i've got an old classic um 50 year old motorbike she's a beauty <coughs> it's only a 185 it's only a little thing a suzuki G uh, gt 185 oh it's lovely my boy's, uh, my eldest son, he's got a 125, so we just go out together. The cuttings along here with the bridges on top are fantastic. Look at that. Oh, hang on. Hold up, hold up. We've got a lot of right, uh, reds here. So you got a um, a platinum on that, Shane. Did was it a hard platinum, or did you just absolutely beast it? I mean, surely they're going to expect you to do some of them tasks um, or the trials on like ultra hard, are they? Your wife wants you to do the tell her the f no, go and see it, sneaky. Yeah, go and do it, mate. You know it's for the best. <laughs> Have you got to the fairground yet, Morts? <coughs> Yeah, exactly, Power. I've had a fast bike, and uh, I'm, I'm getting too old for all that now. Can I see a picture of a classic, uh, a classic bike? Um, it's on my Twitter, but it'll be like miles back. 
uh, yeah, it's, um, yeah, uh, I can't think where, it, I know it's on my Twitter, but it would be a while back, yeah. How long has Susie been sitting? It's too straight. You might want to give the spark plug a wee gentle clean. Yeah, it was all service, wasn't it? And the, in, the top end was rebuilt. Then I took it out for about 30 or 40 miles. And then it's been sat um, all winter, really. So I'm sure it'll be fine. It was all um, rebuilt, wasn't it? Because I blew a piston. I'll show you. I'll show you the piston. Uh, can I show you the piston? Well, it's not that interesting. But yeah, the piston's got a hole in it. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, do him in the morning. <laughs> yeah, when he brought it back, he went, everyone has been stopping and looking at this bike, and uh, it's in such good nick, and the bottom end was perfect, and we've rebuilt the top end, so yeah, it's really good. Bloody hell, I'm not making any mistakes today. You're not used to this, are you? If you want to see my piston mark, I will show it to you. Use your rig so many times, hide so many times. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> In every gear, yeah. Oh, the bird's always quiet at night, yeah. Oh, he's eating. He's eating. Do you want to come out, birdie boy? Do you want to come out? You want to come out? Yeah, of course he wants to come out. Yeah, he's, this is late for him, though. Do you want to come out, baby? He might not want to. Come on. No, nah, he's starting to spit at me. He doesn't like to be um, touched of a night. Hey, you want to come out? No, nah, doesn't want to. You have to, you have to, um, you have to respect what they're saying. And after about seven, eight o'clock, he just wants to nibble his food, get in his corner and go to sleep. Yeah, you don't touch him. He never, like, tries to attack me or anything. Um course not they're not really that sort of bird but he will give a little like a pretend spit if he's not happy and then you just leave him yeah <clears throat> a bird that does not like being touched at night oh mark 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 and <laughs> you just got to say the right words haven't you? you say the right words but they've got to be in the right order it's like one of them puzzles isn't it you know you can say the right words but at the wrong time or in a different order and then suddenly you, you say them in the right order and it unlocks it's uh <laughs> how does capri know it's night if he doesn't see daylight well he's got a, a body clock isn't he yeah he's got a body clock and he gets light from the door being open so i suppose he'll get some sense of that but yeah he's got a, he's got a body clock hasn't he if you don't mind don't blame me no 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 it's all good oh we've got a nice signal box there i love a signal box if I ever won the lottery and there was one being dismantled and sold, I would buy that uh, and have a massive model railway in the top. You know, if you like big lottery money, I'd have that in the garden. Yeah. Or an old train carriage and convert that and have some genuine sort of railway track, a section of railway track um, in the garden, whatever that would be, if you're a massive lottery winner. And um, I'd have it all done out and I'd have a model railway in that. I've got plans. <laughs> Hello, Skippy. How are you? Right, 0 0.9. We've got a yellow. Yeah, it's, it'd be cool, wouldn't it? Go Pete Waterman. Yeah, yeah. Still had a platform. That'd be awesome, wouldn't it? There's a couple of um, like bike trails in the Isle of Wight, actually, that used to be um, like the station. You can hire bikes. And then you can just pedal for miles on what used to be railway track underneath, basically like this, underneath bridges. Uh, really good. Yeah, really good. <laughs> Daniel's watching. <laughs> Daniel is watching. Thank God he is. Two young lads are in, let, raised 10k. Well, you know, they're the ones that burnt it down, didn't you? <laughs> what should we do this weekend? 
<laughs> I'm only joking, Mons. How can we be the devil and a hero all in one weekend? <laughs> Lovely on. Do you play this, Ken? I can't remember. I think you do fiddle with this a little bit, don't you? Always, Mark. Not always. No, that's a lie. Oh, here we go. This is what the uh, red light was for. I don't know how they do it, but they, they really portray the trains to have that sort of weight behind them. They really do feel like they're big, hunking, fucking 10 ton plus, whatever they would uh, weigh. They don't float, do they? They sort of, they do ride on the rails really well, which is obviously a, such an important part to train sim, but they've just got it right. I just love the way they do that. Right, stop at location. Okay. This is a lovely line, isn't it? Don't even need to be in there to make sure. Look at this. Look. Oh, look, 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 look. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Poos is missing out on his handiwork, yes, yeah. 100 hours, oh nice, nice. Do they not cling to the rail? I just said riding on top of the rail, didn't I? That's what they do, isn't it? They ride on top, but they've got the flanges on the inside to stop it going left or right off the rail. So, yeah. You've been practicing? I haven't. I bloody haven't. Let's have a look at some more railway, interesting railway shots. That's quite a nice, that's quite a nice shot. Modern. Interesting, clean. Oh, we're done. We're done. Oh, I didn't want that to end. Um, should we carry on, do another scenario here? <laughs> Flange, yeah, exactly. Is this a request, uh, <laughs> Matt? <laughs> should we do the next one? Flood. It's going to be raining. Nice. Let's do it. Yeah, let's carry on. And then the game just gets better when it does this, doesn't it? Look at it. Look. Look at that. <laughs> Proper cosy, isn't it? Matches the stream title. Oh, uh, uh, oh okay. apparently I, I um, placed something. We've got to talk to this geezer. Hello, madam, sir. Uh, good afternoon. We re re we've received reports that a water pipe has burst near Wolfenstone. It's causing major disruptions. All right, let's do it. Where is this setting for? He's always running. I don't want him to run. Where's 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 that controls? He's always running. I don't want him to run. Where would it be? Hmm. <coughs> <coughs> hmm. Because if look, he's running. I press shift and he slows down. He's ran the wrong way. I don't want him to run all the time. I mean, you know, I wouldn't run all the time. 
Shut that door. Oh, no, shut that. Shut that door. There we go. Let's sit in here. Lovely. Oh, is it in accessibility? Oh, okay. I don't know why I didn't think of looking there, really. Accessibility. Is it? Default movement. Walk. Thank you very much. Thank you. Nothing to miss here. It's fucking depressing. <laughs> Oh my god, look at that. That is gonna that is proper cozy, isn't it? Come on. That is really cool. Right. Are you all set for a, a cozy evening with me? Press the panties up, yeah, yeah. Daytime running. Where's that? Where are you? Uh set it to day. Unlock the doors. Yeah, that is cool, isn't it? I like that. It's nice that they've got umbrellas now. There's a lot of umbrellas, though. Isn't it annoying when everyone's walking around with their umbrellas and fucking hell, you nearly get your eye taken out, didn't you? It's like, come on. It's just, it's n sometimes it's not even raining. You're like, fuck off. <laughs> That is going to be cool. It's V for wiper, isn't it? Intermittent. Yeah, that'll do. It's not like we're um, doing 60 on the motorway. It doesn't have to be wiping all the time, does it? I actually like this train. It's a really easy train to, to um, drive and stop. It's the most uh, particular one. Hang on. Oh, set the reverse of the forward. Yeah, got you, got you. Always read. Why is it red, though? Set it to forward, but why is the red square? What have I done? What have I done wrong? British ice! <laughs> what have I... What have I, what have I done to deserve this? All right, so yeah, we're forward. It's still red. What do you reckon, lads and ladies, of course? I'll take advice from women. I don't mind. It's all good. <laughs> I might restart it. Let's restart. I, uh, uh, yeah, check pantograph. I'm going to restart it just to see um, what I did wrong. Yeah, it, we're right at the beginning anyway, so it's fine. <laughs> Massive derail coming up. Yeah, all right. The flood. Let's do it. Let's try it. I think I know what this man's going to say. Oh, I think I'm psychic. All right, let's take a, a proper note of what's going on. That's better. He's walking. That's better, isn't it? Now, now I want to run everywhere because it's my choice. <laughs> Shut that door. Oh, no, we've already done that, haven't we? <laughs> okay, set the master key to in. Set it to secure. Press this, the AC button. Press the up button. Done. That's it. Because the red's still around the, the uh, thing at the moment, right? Just keep an eye on that. Um, set it to day. And set that to on. Yeah, because we're still red at the moment. Still red. <laughs> Are you really, power? Yeah. I think I'm going to try and get the, um, the platinum on that. Just because I like playing it. It's so easy to play, isn't it?
Right, we're loading passengers. All it should be is close the doors and set to forward, yeah, yeah. Lock the doors. Right, doors are shut. Set it to forward. Apply some power, but it, it it's it's still exactly the same. What have I what have I done wrong? I haven't opened any other doors, have I? What what do you reckon that is? In all seriousness, what do you reckon that is? Hmm. There's emergency. No, that hasn't reset it either. That is a strange one. Now I'm interested in what we're doing. I say we. Now I'm interested in what we're doing wrong. Hello, Kim. How are you? Because like, I haven't done anything that anyone else wouldn't have done, would I? I'm going to restart it one more time. Possibly a bug. Yeah, yeah. I'll tell you what isn't a bug. Pressing the, the little like button. <laughs> you see what I did there? <laughs> brake release, yeah. And this parking brake is on? Maybe, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm still following the progress, yeah. Right, let's do it one more time. Maybe we've got to wait for a measure to fill up or a, a, a something to fill up. Hmm, I don't think so, but... Hello, Stevens, how are you? Yeah, hopefully you've left me a little cheeky like. Look, see how you press likes and more people come in. That's how it works. Cozy <laughs> evening watching the main menu. Yeah, all right, Mark. Bloody hell. He's straight in for the juggler. Ugh, isn't he? See, now I want to run everywhere. Now he's too slow. Right, let's do this. Come on. Let's do exactly how the game tells us to do it. This is the third time lucky. Right, press the AC button. Press the panties up button. Press it to day. Press it to on. Unlock doors. still red, isn't it? Has it even got like a train brake? Has it got a train brake? Hmm. Okay, the red box came back on the second you hit. Oh, did it? What, what did I hit? <laughs> George! God, you're filthy. Check to see if the panties are up on the exterior. <laughs> They're not. It's not. Well, is it? Oh, no, it is. Well, is that classed as up? I mean, it's not touching, but is it up? Yeah, that's that there. That's, that's nothing to do with it. What is going on? That's really weird, isn't it? Because I've just done three times exactly what the menu has, sh has shown us. Doors. Uh, I don't think it's doors because, like, they're shut. Oh, that door is still... Oh, okay. Oh, that's weird. Now it's working. What did we do different then? Yeah, that that was weird. Because we did shut the doors before. We checked, didn't we? <laughs> Stop this, I'm getting a taxi. Oi, you just bloody stay there now. <laughs> Control alt delete. Yeah, it's not that bad, is it? There we go. Anyway, back to the cosy evening. Alright, which this is. Look at this. Look, this is this is proper. Hello, Bex, how are you? I think it might have been a dumb passenger. Three times we tried that, Poots. How are you, mate? Oh, look at this. Look. Class 66, is that? Beautiful. Someone at some... I think someone had glitched the door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. 
All right, let's keep an eye on everything. Oh, I love the rain though as well, the way it's all sort of veering off to one side. This is like eye racing rain now. <laughs> right, 1.2 miles, we've got a green. Everything is A-OK -okay and beautiful. Oh, look at that. I'm hunting for good um, photo opportunities. They all seem happy, don't they? Oh, is it raining out there, Kim? Yeah, it started to rain in here earlier. Oh, this just looks spectacular, doesn't it? The only way this would look better is at night, I think, or maybe a bit more towards night. It, this is beautiful. Best streams were COVID streams? Well, you know, that was a couple of years ago. I'd like to think that, you know, we're still doing all right, and we, and we mark. <laughs> oh, it does. It looks lovely. Although, is that... Hang on a minute. That's a bit very close, isn't it? But it's not touching, so that's fine. We've got a green. Yeah, thank you for coming in, though. Joining me for that cosy evening. Because uh, I won't be streaming after this for about a week. Um, it's half term. I always like to do family stuff at half term. So, uh, yeah, this is the last stream for about a week, ten days. But I'll be back after that. It's not fair. Yeah. Right, we're stopping at that location. So, we're just going to put a cheeky break on. I've got this. I've got this tonight. This is proper cosy in this cab, though, isn't it? Look at that. Look. Video games, eh? Who'd have them? Absolutely stunning. What a what a subject for a video game. Oh, is it not? It's not even counting. That I've st oh, how could you do that to me? Insert the key and switch to what? 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 Yeah, it is in. Oh, what? <laughs> what are you doing? What? What? <laughs> What's happened now? It hasn't. It hasn't bloody done it. What's going on? What's happened? I know. I think I did break it. Are the doors open? No, the doors aren't open. I just need to move forward a little bit more. Is it the door? No, I don't think it is. No, I'm trying to pull forward. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to do. Yeah, no, I'm trying to. It won't let me. That's absolutely what I want to do. Look, we've got the red, we've got the red thing around it again, which is weird. <laughs> Other side. Oh. That's fine. It's not letting them unlock, which is totally fine. Yeah, that's normal, isn't it? You need to be closer to the stopping point. No, no, I get that taste. So I want to move forward. It won't let me. It won't let me do anything. It just won't let me. Yeah. Master switch is off. Uh, no, it's all in. It's all in. Reverser is on shutdown, though. Oh, David, thank you very much, mate. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thanks very much, mate. Yeah, that's in. Reverser is on forward. And it seems to like me, but... Um, <laughs> this is why trains are late. Yeah, David, thank you very much for that, mate. I appreciate that. Don't forget, if you're not in Discord, come into Discord. Connect your Discord to your YouTube. You'll go green in there as well. You'll see the members room. I give away lots of codes. I've given away some really good codes this week, haven't I? They'll tell you. 
they'll tell you. Um, turn the train off and then turn it back on again. Thanks, Joseph. Thanks, mate. Lock the doors. No, the doors are locked. Ah, right door's locked. It wasn't saying that earlier. It was only just saying unlocked. Right, let's go back to zero. Is it going to go white? No. What the fuck? <laughs> Joseph isn't... No, I know. I know he's right. I think I'm going to have to start it again. Oh, fuck it, I'm going to start it again. <laughs> this is the fourth time restarting this one. <laughs> Doors are now open. Oh, Daniel, come on. Leave it out, mate. <laughs> Joseph is an engineer. You can tell from his advice. Yeah. Yeah. Right, hopefully it works this time. Well, we had three attempts to get the actual train moving, Poods. Yeah. Yeah, it's, not, it's just me that's broke. Look at that water just glistening off the top there. Look. So cool. Right. Okay. Let's do it. No, the, the problem we had here for free restarts was the red square around the gears, but I'm sure it would be fine this time. Press the AC button, press the panties, bu panties up button. <laughs> Robert, I think that's the best way, isn't it? Okay. I'll try not to break it this time. Don't worry. It's a cosy evening of breaking trains. All right, remember that. I will look outside. We did that before. Thank you very much for coming in, though. Lovely route. Look at it. Beautiful. I know, claimed. You'd have two, wouldn't you? You'd have two. Right. Lock the doors. And we'll actually have a proper look as well. Excuse me, madam. They got sort of sucked inside the tree. A uh, tray? Uh, the train. Okay. Now, set it to forward. All right. Oh, no, it's going to be fine this time. Okay, that's fine. There we go. Taste. He never forgets that one, does he, Joseph? Taste never forgets that, and I can't blame him, to be honest with you. Take four, yeah. Right, we're stopping at location, so we're stopping at 1.6 miles. This is going to be, this is going to, people are going to talk about this for years. That's how smooth this is going to go. does look really good though doesn't it i'm streaming in 2k as well 1440p so if you are watching on a mobile that's got that or a pc that's got that you go to your free dots put the quality up why not make youtube work for their money we're still using miles in the uk yeah why wouldn't we convince the missus to get it <laughs> you will never learn I know Don I know it's like next you'll be demanding that UK drivers on the other side of the road come on keep up it's fine as it is it's fine Can you imagine if that ever did happen here, the changeover day? Oh, God, there'd be so many accidents, wouldn't there? <clears throat> right, we're just coasting. Love the way that rain then draws to the left. I love that. 
Okay, so we're stopping at this location, but the brakes are really good on this, so we're not gonna we're not gonna overshoot on this one. <laughs> Look at that. So bloody cool. We're just coasting into town. Arm out the window, looking cool. I'm just going to take it easy. We're not going to, we're not going to have any mishaps. No graffiti, no, but graffiti gets cleaned off every every now and again. Maybe they set it how it should be. Speed up, Grandpa, come on. Oh, shut up, Iraq. Leave off. I said no overshooting. I'm not going to be able to do that and speed up. <laughs> right, let's not stop too bloody early as well. <laughs> you just reset the train. <laughs> you can't have it all, all right? Hello, Oscar. How are you? Stunning. That is stunning, isn't it? Come on. Come on. That is... Can, can I have a round of applause or something? I mean, how does it work? How, how does that... Come on, that's brilliant. Hopefully, some old lady doesn't sort of come out and fall on this, admittedly. Yeah, that looks dodgy. But other than that... Plonk. Face first into it. <laughs> oh, fucking meat grinder. <laughs> no, just a normal clap. Not a bloody slow one. Yeah, I'm alright, Oscar. Thank you very much. I've been looking... Oh, careful, mate. I've been looking... For oh, he's... Michael Jackson's back... Backed in there, look. Hee <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Show my chain, motherfucker. Exactly, Mark. Exactly. Crusader, 28 months. Thank you very much, mate. You can complain all you want. I've got deaf ears, mate. It's fine. It's all good. Ah, it's just so good, isn't it? Look, look at that. Look. The sound as well. The sound has improved with this game. Oh, more. Hey, yes! Yes! bex has got it. Thank you, Morts. <laughs> yes! Only took about a grand, didn't it? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> that one was for the MJ impression. <laughs> Finally, I know. She might not even be here. She might have just put it on and gone to do something else. Bex, are you here? <laughs> the last non-member, yeah. Oh, that was brilliant. Finally, yeah. <laughs> How am I going to earn any money now? God. <laughs> Welcome, Bex. Don't forget, come into the members' room. That's where Glenn posts all his um, naughty pictures. Oh, this looks just miserable, doesn't it? But in a nice kind of way. If you was a train driver, this is Monday morning. You'd just be thinking, I'll tell you what, I've got a bloody good job. I'm sitting here, the little heater's on. Uh, I'm on my phone most of the time. <laughs> I'm watching a stream. I'm in Game Tech stream. I've got a bloody good job. Oh, I better stop. That's what they'll be thinking, wouldn't they?
There's probably cameras in these nowadays, do you think? Oh, I think it does, Shane. Yeah, I, th I think I think ETS is on par. It definitely uh, does between stations. Certainly, uh, watch a stream or two. Come on. That's all right, Robert. No one ever has to, you know, it's never... I don't promote it, do I? I know some of the mods put the little um, uh, thing in there, which is great, but you never hear me mention it. People know it's there, and if you want to support, you support, but you don't have to, absolutely not. Yeah. The only thing I do um, for members that, you know, doesn't get done for um, subscribers is the members-only stream and... Um, lots of codes in the give in the members room and they're good codes as well like that yeah all right Matt calm down <laughs> That's what I think, David, about trucking. I think I'd fall asleep. Whenever I get in the car, I find it so relaxing that I end up getting sleepy. <laughs> Learning how to drive from a famous huge Well, it wouldn't be me then, would it? That'd be British Ace. Right, 1.1. 1 .1. We're stopping there as well. Look at this. This is just so cosy. I'm glad I chose that stream title because that is perfect, isn't it? That does annoy me. I'm sure it's something to do with the game engine, but you know when you come out, you go there, and it like it's not raining. Oh, then it is raining. Then it is. <laughs> he got police cars as well. <laughs> oh shit. We got the wanker horn in this one. <laughs> I'm a terrible ambassador, aren't I? <laughs> you wouldn't find British Ace doing that, would you? <laughs> it's not you're trying to crash. It's trying to keep your attention, Puck, all right? That's all. <laughs> Right, we're just coasting into town a little bit. Here we go. This is a really nice line, actually. Really nice. I like the way it's pretty much raised up the entire way through. Police livery for class 37. Yeah, yeah, we could, uh, we could, we could do that, couldn't we? <laughs> <clears throat> oh, we better stop here. no different to your car is it Christopher you get to know your car and plus they, they're highly trained as well probably at least an afternoon course well I realistically don't see that I'd be able to do better than that let's have a look around while they're uh, in there look, look at all this detail look It's the arches. Go down the arches. Yeah. Beep. Ah, oh, tickets. Are, the, the doors are open. That really annoys me. They invest in these um, these things, but people still go through because they're not manned. We've got one at our station. It's there, and obviously someone paid for it to be installed. And uh, and after about sort of six o'clock at night, there's no one there. You don't have to buy a ticket. Ridiculous. <laughs> bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? Hello, Glenn. Guess what? Bex is part of the team. She's always been part of the team. She's part of the elite cream. That's what she's part of.
It happened, Glenn, before your very eyes. Yeah, I like the way the, the train here is uh, really high. It's quite high up through the town, isn't it? <laughs> Everyone hide. <laughs> He's alright, that Glenn. Mr. Train Guy, bloody hell, he's in the right stream, isn't he? Oh, we're stopping at this location. Whoa, chuck the anchors out. It's fine. Everything's fine. Don't panic, everybody. Just gonna let them know Horny Jay's here. <laughs> oh, dear. Make myself cringe sometimes. Is he though? Is he really though? <laughs> what's red and bad? What's red and bad for your teeth? Oh god, do I even want to know the answer to that? Oh god, it didn't do it again. It didn't do it. I'm not going to touch anything. It's fine. A brick. I like summer teeth. Some are yellow, some are broken, some are... <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, it's still... Oh, no, I think I've messed it up again. I thought... It... Oh, God. I think I've messed it up. Oh, no, it's all right. Hang on. It's really picky, this one. I mean, norm... ordinarily, that wouldn't moan like that, would it? No shit, Joseph. That's really fussing. You can't redo my joke, David. Come on. My teeth are yellow. <laughs> okay, David. I got you. Why out, man? I'm meant to be looking around for these posters. I never bother with that. Does anyone else? The <laughs> joke cops. Yes, David, and I will have you arrested. This is the PlayStation version. This is the PC version, Robin. How's your steak dinner? Yeah, down the Bernie Inn. Yeah, it's still relatively um, system hungry. Yeah, it, it does take a bit of power to run it. We had that at the start of the stream. I think the, the, the trick is just to, you know, get the resolution you want and then just turn a few settings down, which is what I've done. And now it's running solid 60, beautiful 4K. Not everything's on Epic, um, which you think I'd be able to do on a 4070, but yeah. Some are put down to medium, some to high. But it still looks lovely, doesn't it? Right, we're stopping at the next location. It's a really interesting line, because you're stopping quite, quite a lot, aren't you? Almost like the underground, really. I'm using the 28-inch in front of me here, Robin. Yeah, nothing too big. David, why are you... Calm down, David. I think David's had one of them um, green hooches tonight. You're so mature these days. Gone are the late night streams of a JD. Well, hang on a minute before you come in. It's fucking quarter to nine. What are you talking about? Come back in later then. It's not even late night, is it? God dear. Put it in the review. Put me on TripAdvisor. <laughs> no, 40, um, 
Yeah, 47 then. Why'd you upgrade? Why does anyone upgrade? Yeah. Try and make it better for you. That's what I was trying to do. And then bloody... Um, Wadey's come in. Oh, oh, you're no fun. Oh, shit. It's fine. It's fine. Right, okay. We need to show... Uh, we need uh, some safe, health and safety bloody uh, meetings here. Oh, you're just no fun when you're sober. <laughs> I'm always sober. That's it. Luckily, they know the score. I give them a bit of a wink out the door and went, look, don't. You'll get me sacked. No, the one thing that I always want is the best possible quality stream I can get in sound and, um, you know, how the graphics look. That's always been a thing. So, yeah, I had a 38 in there. Didn't really need to upgrade. I had a bit of a deal at work going on. Um, so, yeah, just did a sort of almost like PlayStation 5 Pro as a po they ju I just made my PC into sort of like PC Pro. You know, it's not, it wasn't a major upgrade. Um, but it was just an upgrade that um, was noticeable. And if it just makes sure that the stream is, is as smooth as possible, then that that's everything. Yeah. Yeah, like PC Pro, you know what I mean? It's like a just an interim. That will last me another 18 months. I won't have to even think about it. Certainly for one year. I won't have to think about my PC for the next 18 months, or a year to an 18 months. And then I'll do a replacement. That's what I, It's almost like the Pro. That's what I do in my PCs. I have my PC, and then I make it into a Pro. Usually processor, maybe more RAM. I mean, it's got 128 gigabyte of RAM in it now. I won't need to touch that for 18 months. And then I'll buy a whole new system. <coughs> you right, Dave? Only with a radiator cooler. It's not like water cooled with a water going round it. No, I don't want to get into that. Have you got this on console? Yeah, yeah. But PC is where they send me the codes because that's where I think it runs and looks best. To be honest with you, and the control scheme, I much prefer doing this on a keyboard. Yeah, I know what you mean, David, but I'm all right with my PC. I'm, you know, the reason, one of the reasons, again, I got the 40 series. It's got the, um, it's got the MVENC chip for streaming. So if you are streaming and playing on the same machine, like the 3080, for example, you're using a lot of the guts of that card. The 40 series is theoretically, to simplify it, got a separate trip, a uh, separate chip which will be um, take all the power for streaming, still leaving you the power for the game. That's the reason I really wanted the 40 series card. I couldn't afford a 48 or a 4090. It's just silly, silly money. It didn't do it again. Bloody hell, it's really, really fussy. Hope you're not ditching console streams for one of these sims. Uh, look back on the channel. There's every platform. Every platform. Oh, for... F Ultimately, though, on something like this, it doesn't really matter what platform I'm playing on. It doesn't affect the game. Thank you. Yeah, it shouldn't really aff affect the viewing experience, what platform I'm on. But I do prefer this, this particular game on PC because it's just the control scheme. The graphics it, it is better on PC. This is one game where, um, yeah. Do you ever overclock your GPs? No, nah, David, no. Nah. No. Nah. No, nah, it's not worth it. It just is not worth it. You've got to up your cooling. They're never as reliable. And after time, once you get reliability problems because you're, you're trying to overclock, you're only copying what someone else is doing on YouTube or, or a guide. You end up going, fuck this, I'm putting it back to default settings and that's how I should have been. And then you end up enjoying it from that moment onwards. The problem is that can take you a year to get to that stage because it's just, it's just pointless. Just buy a better card. You know, I know that sounds a bit... If you really want to overclock, just buy a slightly better card and don't overclock it. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I don't know if you agree with that. Some people like the overclocking. Um, and you can put a tune on there. Like in your in your BIOS, you can put like a like a tune. So basically just, just ups it a little bit without sort of getting into the whole overclocking thing. But no, I don't normally touch it. No. 
Your headlights aren't on. <laughs> well, head marker, it says day. That's what the game told me to put it on. I think you'll find something's on. <laughs> Your headlights aren't on. My ear's getting hot. <laughs> I know you didn't mean it like that, New York, but that's how, that's how I read it. My ear's getting hot. <laughs> What does overclocking a PC mean? Basically going into the um, the settings of the hardware itself. So it's designed to be at one clock speed and you're forcing it to run faster than it should. And some people get good results out of it. For some people it's the absolute hobby. You know, for some people that's it. They play around with trying to get the best settings they can with the massive cooling and then going back into the sort of uh, benchmark program and just getting a better score than whoever they're competing with. Yeah, I've never been that interested in that. Yeah, sims are a great way to game. I mean, this is just going from one station to the other. Theoretically, it should be boring, shouldn't it? It should be, but it's not. Oh, thank you, New York. After that insult I just gave you as well. <laughs> by reading out your comment like that. Thank you, New York. I appreciate that. Thank you. Don't forget, New York. I don't know if you're already in Discord, but if you come in Discord, um, you can attach your Discord name now to your um, to your YouTube channel. And if you've got benefits on your YouTube channel, like being a member, we've made it so if you go into settings in Discord connections, put your YouTube in, you'll go green in there. Your name will go green like it is now. And you'll see an extra room, a members room. And in there I put co uh, free codes for different games, different platforms. But I appreciate that, New York. Thank you very much. All right, I've learnt my lesson now. Thirty ninety sixty four 64 gig of RAM, yeah. Beautiful, David, there's nothing... I mean, that's going to do you for... That'll do you for the next 18 months, won't it? Hello, team. Yeah, I'm going to go and get some um, some JD in a minute. What's the time? Because I like to please the crowd. <laughs> it's 9 o'clock. I better not start already. <laughs> yeah, things are lovely, Derek. Thank you very much. Oh, I managed to go to the doctors today. Yeah, my wife... Um, I had to go to work, so I had to get up early. And she uh, was off work today. So she's like, well, you're too bloody lazy to do it. So I'll do it. Uh, guess how many times, in a realistic number, how many times she had to ring the doctor before she got through, like engaged, engaged, engaged. Yep. Hee <laughs> hee. Ha ha, you didn't get on. You have to ring our doctor at 8 o'clock to get a, um, an appointment if you want one the same day. How many times do you reckon she tried? Realistically, not like 500, but a realistic number. 32? Yeah, 10 times. Okay. Any more for any more? Nine. 65. And then she was on hold for 15 minutes as well. 65 times she had to try. I got an appointment at um, 4 o'clock. Went in there. Lovely. It was fine. One. Oh, bloody hell. 65 times. And when she got through, then she was on hold for 15 minutes. But she did that for me because I keep worrying about me hernia. He had a little look, he had a little prod, and I think he enjoyed it more than I did, that's for sure. Uh, <laughs> but he said, oh, it's only a little one, it's not that serious, we'll send you for a scan. Don't worry too much, it's all good. So that was alright. You just walk in here if you don't have an appointment. Really, Giggles? Yeah, yeah, but you pay though, don't you? We're part of the NHS. Yeah, you, you've got private medical over there, haven't you? Yeah, slightly different. We're just, uh, it all comes out of our tax and then we're all free everything's free but yeah so uh, nothing crazy to worry about I know you're not worried anyway but <laughs> he's like oh you're having an egg <laughs> these are just things as you get older I suppose he's like have you got a strenuous job no oh, okay yeah, do you do lifting no I said, I'm lazy I sit down all day oh okay 
I pay for prescriptions, yeah. Were you asking giggles? <clears throat> he said, just be, just be careful with it. Don't go lifting. And I'm like, well, the gym's just opened up. Um, you definitely think I shouldn't go there, didn't you? And he went, no, you can go to the gym. It's fine. You haven't just got to sit down and wait for your appointment. You carry on. Just don't do any heavy lifting. Oh, for fuck's sake, you know. That was my way out. <laughs> Hello, Tracy. How are you? I don't know yet about that. Um, yeah, I don't know about that, actually. Um, New York, I'm sure it will be. How many eggs do you think you could eat in one sitting? What sort of eggs? Fried? Poached? Hard-boiled? Um, Cadbury's? <laughs> what ones? How's the birds? Ah, oh, the bird's lovely. Yeah, the bird's beautiful. He's probably in the corner. Yep, he's in his uh, in, in his bed position. He doesn't like to be disturbed of a night. Who does? Sometimes you'll hear he just lets out a little screech as if to say, "Shut up!" <laughs> yeah, they are, Christopher. Yeah, and education is free up there as well, isn't it? Proper eggs. You choose how they're cooked. Oh, okay. Um. I think out of all the eggs, I, if I wanted to have a competition, I think I'd choose fried. Yeah, yeah, I think I'd choose fried eggs. And, uh, 20? I mean, it wouldn't be hard, would it? 20 eggs? Yeah, got to be. <laughs> Fertilised. How do you like your eggs in the morning? Uh, Unfertilised, if possible. What's with this sort of um, AI doing slideys and walking? What's happened? What? That didn't used to do that, did it? Poached is nice, yeah. Po that, yeah, yeah. Poached is nice. I think we need Mr. Motivator to do a PlayStation VR game, get you in shape, yeah. <laughs> Mr. Motivator. <laughs> it would be, Ken. Well, mine are anyway. <laughs> Got the scissors on that. It's fine. <laughs> Talking of cream eggs, you're munching some there. When you say some, how many are you eating? And how many cream eggs could you eat? I think three before I start to think I've made a bad choice here. I don't think more than three. Some people seem to think they could do 40. Bloody hell. Yeah, the boiled eggs seem quite... Uh, they're, they're chewy and they're... Mm. No, I think fried for me if I was going to have a competition. How do you eat your cream egg? Do you go in, you bite off the top, you lick out the middle a little, a little bit, then you go with the rest. Is that how you do yours? Uh, tell me how you do yours. Yeah, tell me how you... Uh, uh, it wasn't that the, the advert, how do you eat yours? How do you eat? How do you explain how you eat it without sounding like an absolute perv? See you later, Mark. Bite off the top, lick out the middle, eat the rest. <laughs> Keep talking. <laughs> oh, boss. Oh. <laughs> Too much. Too much, man. <gasps> oh, we've got we've got a new uh, oh god bite off the top, right, which is fine. Scoop out the middle with, <laughs> with your finger, <laughs> and then what do you do with that bit? Uh, yeah, because you haven't you haven't told us what you do with that bit. What do you do with it? So you've gone um, scoop out the middle with my finger and then finish it off. What do you do with this bit though? You didn't tell us, did you? See you later, Mark. <laughs> Mark's like, okay, bye. I can't take this anymore. <laughs> this is too erotic.
We have a winner. Oh my God, come on. This ain't like the old days. I'm not going to fall out of my train anymore. At least I don't think so. Reading cream eggs as a Dutch guy. What the heck is cream eggs? It's chocolate in the shape of an egg with like a fondant, white, thick fondant juice on the inside with a little bit of yellow as if it's like a, a thing. It's wrapped in a very um, thin foil. You've probably got something similar, yeah. <laughs> David, what the fuck? What the... What? What the shit, David? Come on, that's too much. <laughs> the filling is too sweet. And wasn't there uproar a little while ago? Um, because they changed the... the uh, have I shut the doors? No, yeah, it's fine. Yeah, um... <laughs> no, they're not disgusting. No, they're, they're nice, they're nice. I'm sure you've probably got them. I'm sure you have. Thought he was alone in the dark stream tonight. Yeah, we did touch on it, Andrew, and then um, we sort of uh, we changed our mind. <laughs> it's a sugar hand grenade. Give one to a small child and stand well back. Yeah, caramel eggs are better. Yeah, but they're just chocolate, aren't they? They haven't got that that surprise, have they? Sixty grams of sugar. Is it really? Oh my god. It would be um, good if this was multiplayer. Yeah, it would be that. Yeah. You've had one sitting in your fridge for a few months. Are you, are you sure it's not like a normal egg that's just turned a little bit funny? The worst bit is... Um, the worst bit about a cream egg is... If you get a bit of foil... And you haven't realised, and you bite down. Look <laughs> it out! <laughs> yeah, that completely does you in, doesn't it? Well, it does me in anyway. Can anyone bite ice cream here? <gasps> Who can bite ice cream? That's a skill, isn't it? Maybe two, yeah. You're trying to get a new channel sponsor. <laughs> oh, hello. We've got another winner. Look at this. Come on, you can get better than this. Oh, my God. The gooey, messy ones. Oh, I want a bloody cream egg now. I might send my wife out. Do you think that's unfair? <laughs> I might text her. <gasps> should we text her? Oh, God, should we do a wife test? Do you remember when we used to do a wife test? Do you remember that? And we all used to do it. And we used to text our wives, make us a cup of tea, love. And uh, we see who, who, who <laughs> if one turns up. <laughs> I'm going to do it. <clears throat> Right, I'm going to text. What are <laughs> the chances of two cream eggs delivered to me? <laughs> In brackets, wife test. Oh, fucking hell. Send... Yeah, let's send. Let's send. Let's do it. <laughs> I'll send some flowers to your wake. Let's do it. We'll see. It's not being read. And you can reply back in voice if you want so the whole stream can hear it. So I'll do a little voice note. And then she'll do one. And I think it'll probably be swearing. <laughs> 
Oh, you got to have fun, though, haven't you? Can I have your PC when she kills you? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, she knows how money playful. Oh, nice. Signal box uh, review. Look, here we go. Get up there, you f get fucking up there. That's it. That's it, that'll do. I'm disabled already. She can't do any more damage. Want to bet? Hello, Elgarth. Oh, my wife would do anything for me. As she knows, I would do anything for her. She hasn't read it yet. I'll keep you... Um, I mean, if she's out of shower or bath or whatever, and like she's in her jammers, feet up, watching telly, it's going to be really slim. If she's just mooseling around out there, she might think... Actually, I'll have one as well, and she'll do it. Right, we're stopping. Should we go for, to a different route after this one? Keep it fresh? Have you tried the honey JD? Yeah, of course I have. My, my favourite one is apple. Apple JD is lovely. <laughs> if you're right in Jason's will, I'll have the RK cabinet. <laughs> it is new DLC, yeah. Yeah, you do not divorce this, boss. Look, check this out. You don't divorce this. Do you, Ken? <laughs> yeah, Apple JD. I don't have it with anything. I have a proper man on its own. Nothing else. What wing of the house does Kaz live in? <laughs> Dibs on the rig. You can all have the VR. I don't want it. Johnny, thank you very much, mate. How are you? Right, stop at location. Hang on. Yeah, what did you think of uh, Ghostbusters Melody? You got Dead Man's Finger. Yeah, you have to lick the cream off. You can't just leave it there, otherwise you'll get uh, Dead Man's Finger. I'd divorce you in a heartbeat, yeah, but you'd enjoy the marriage though, wouldn't you? You'd enjoy your time here. <laughs> I don't like cinnamon. Yeah, I don't like cinnamon though. Oh, thank you, Johnny. I appreciate you. <laughs> thank you very much, Johnny. Yeah, definitely, Beard. Watch it again. Yeah. Thanks, Johnny. I appreciate that. Oh, this must be the end of the line, because I ain't fucking going anywhere after this. See if she's read it. <gasps> she hasn't read it. Oh, God. Oh, now I'm in suspense now. <laughs> of course I fucking would. <laughs> <laughs> At least he's honest, isn't he? <laughs> Slow start, better second half. Yeah, I think it was just... I, th I don't think with them sort of things, they're ever going to be as good as the original, and you've got to go in with the expectations like that. And if you do, I think you just end up enjoying it. Deliveroo. <laughs> we done. Oh, good. Have you seen it, Joseph? Let's go to a different one, shall we? <laughs> Speed it in red. All right, let's go. Um, let's go main menu. Both me and my missus pointed out to each other. There's there's a lot of um, shots to the camera. Um. I've seen it, it looks really good. There's a lot of shots to the camera of them just holding their guns, going, Aah! Aah! do you know what I mean? There's so many shots of them just looking and going, it, it really grinded on me after a while. Yeah. Uh, yeah, should we uh, to the trains? Choose a route. That one, what was the one we've just done? That was, um, no, that was five, wasn't it? Five Circle, we've just done that. That was the one we've just, no, that was London Overground, wasn't it? Oh, God, yeah, that was that one. So let's do five circle line, yes. Fun around the firth. You're going R. What are you going R for? <laughs> Matt, I knew you'd appreciate that. So there was way too much happening in the movie. It was splitting between old and new. Yeah, I think 
just watch it, enjoy it, watch, enjoy the nostalgia, see it going in a different direction, still see some of the old locations, the old Ghostbusters, it's just enjoyable, yeah, yeah. Right, welcome to the lovely Fife Circle. Is it Fife? Fife Circle. You'd be a pro operating a specialist tourist service that runs across the fourth bridge. <gasps> bridge review, here we go. Oh, this is nice. That's really nice. Look at that. Oh, look, you can see outside as well. Oh, yeah. That's cool. That's really good. I like that. That's a lovely effect, isn't it? Wreckfest with the Thursday night lads. Is that what it <laughs> is that what you call it, Darren? Lads, do you want to meet up for one of those uh, Wreckfest nights? <laughs> of course we do. <laughs> Thanks, Darren. Thanks for coming in, mate. <laughs> You've heard mixed things. Well, let's let's work it out for ourselves. Come on, Mrs. Are you going to read it? Oh, oh, no, oh, shit. Okay. Do you want to hear it? I don't know what it is. I, I've got no idea. It's been a while since I've had a wife text. <laughs> Did you hear that? Did you hear it right? It's been a while since I've had a wife text. <laughs> and what, what, what is the outcome of this test? Do you pass or do you fail? <laughs> Could you hear it right? Best wife in the world she is. Oh my goodness. She's an absolute babe. Oh, this is gonna be cool. So this is this is brand spanking new, isn't it? <laughs> Last rep fest, you all pump me rotten. Yes, yeah. Hello Alan, how are you? A fail. It might be a fail. I dunno, I don't know. We'll we'll see. Right, oh yeah, this is gonna be this is gonna be lovely. Right, set the mark shut the door. Unlock the doors. Yep, Cass sounds young. No, she's not young. She's only a year or two years younger than me. <coughs> Don't start any rumours, Tays. Just because I say she's broken up for school. <laughs> Attack a hornet's nest with a snooker. Cockney Rotten. What's up with you, Dave? Are you getting trolly? Oh, I've got a feeling about you tonight, Dave. What, what's, what's going on with you, Dave? Just just join in. Just chill out. Right, load the imaginary passengers, because there's none here. Yeah, this is very nice. Oh, look. Oh, here we go. Oh, I do love Scotland. Last year... Was it? Yeah, last year we did the... Um, the NC five hundred. Oh, it's beautiful. Too late. <laughs> yeah, it was absolutely stunning. It was a bad time for me. I just had a death in the family, which um, totally threw me, and I can barely remember half of it. And I think it was good for me because I just drove. <laughs> I just drove, and that really helped me. Um, but I think I will do it again because uh, it was lovely. It was beautiful. Some of the sights were like, wow. Yeah, absolutely beautiful. Right. Oh, Wales as well, yeah. Wales is... Wales is beautiful. Wife's bringing me up tea now. No cream eggs, but we got Snickers. Oh, so she's not going out, is she? Let's, uh, let's see if she answered. Uh, no, that was me. She hasn't answered. But she's read it, so I think it'll be alright. That's the beautiful thing of doing stuff like that in front of 170 people. How can she say no? <laughs> 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 but she wouldn't anyway. She wouldn't. Look at that, look. It's so fucking good. I couldn't make it up the Mac loop. I 
just could not make it up there. Last time we went there, my heart was in such a bad condition. Um, that was before I got diagnosed. Uh, I just could not make it up there to the top. It's quite steep. I mean, it's a steep thing. you got to really hold on. And uh, halfway up, I'm just like, oh, God, I don't feel well. This is bad. Yeah. So I would like to go back. Although apparently I don't use it that much now. I don't know whether that's true or not. Hello, Davidoff. How are you? Uh, there is announcements aboard, on board this train. Cool. <laughs> Two cream eggs bounce off me head. <laughs> Was it Waverley? Because I have seen Waverley model, uh, Waverley station in a model form. I don't know. Yeah, you, you're gonna you're gonna know that better than me. <laughs> Maybe taste. Oh God, yeah, yeah. We, I mean, we saw, we saw one. So it was a bit of a waste of time as well. But it's so high that they go below you. You actually see them fly below, which is just brilliant. In fact, on we got a camper van when we went up to Scotland and we stayed on campsites. Um, like half of them had fucking jet planes flying around anyway. There's a lo lot of stuff up there like that, aren't there, Ken? Waverley is the next westbound station. Oh, okay. Yeah, there was one. I remember we I was going to the shower block and heard the... <laughs> looked up like that. I was like, where is it? And my head went like, oh, shit, it's there. It's literally, like, just above you. Yeah, it was really cool. Better than an air show, lower than an air show for sure. <clears throat> so this is a different train. I wonder what the brakes are going to be like on this. Sounds good, doesn't it? Brace yourself, Davidoff. Fucking brace yourself, mate. <laughs> That's what we're talking about, Alan. Yeah, Ram Mac Loop. Look at the lighting on that. Oh my goodness, look. The shadow in. Bloody hell, that's good. Cool. <coughs> Your wife, your wife is the best in the world. You've been married to her for 47 years. Oh, that's lovely, Michael. You get a good marriage. There's just nothing better, is there? You get a missus you can trust and, you know, it's just lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Because half the stresses, or, or, you know, of what you read and when you talk to people, half the stresses of life are to do with your other half. You know, like, you know... He's no good, she's no good, he's doing this, she's doing that. We just don't have any of that. We just, we just don't. Yeah, see you later, Melody. Thank you. Yeah, the weathering's lovely, yeah. I can't do it on request, Joseph. I just can't. Wouldn't be fair. <laughs> Never argue. And it's always, always turned on when you want it, isn't it? <laughs> Too much? The lads are right, uh, late to Retfest. Yeah, they realise what you're up to, Darren. <laughs> oh, God, I'm not going round there again. <laughs> yeah, I got you, El Camo. Don't you worry. No, I know there's no cream eggs in the house. Yeah. Wait for tourists to take pictures of... 
Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Is the game going to be kind to... Oh, come on. We want to have a look in there, don't we? Is this like a football field or rugby field? I don't know. I don't know. You're going to have to tell me. It, it looks like it's like a stadium, obviously. Is it like a music stadium or is it football? Is it rugby? The home of a particular team? You tell me. Home of Scottish rugby. Right. Thank you very much. Wait for tourists to take pictures. Is this a real thing? I mean, they're going to take a picture, but it's going to be behind a filthy <laughs> British railway uh, window, isn't it? <gasps> we got one. Why have I got so much TV in that one? What do you think? Oh. Well, I know what the answer... Well, I know what I'd like the answer to be. <laughs> That's where we pumped the English a few weeks back. Oh, lovely. Right, here we go. Oh, no, I was going to say I'll need a cup of tea as well, but she she already know that. She'll know that. Hello, girls. How are you? Girls, sorry. Girl, girls? Hello, <laughs> girls. Oh, this this looks really nice, though, doesn't it? Do you remember when we used to do option one, option two? This was option one, and option two was like like that, so you see more of the peripheral. And people used to say, "No, nah, do option one. I prefer that." Or or they'd say, "No, nah, no, nah, do a bit of option two. Any OGs remember that? Option two is good because you see you see more of what's going on, don't you? Hello, James. I mean, yeah, of course, it's like the driver's view. But the driver's going to look over there, isn't he? And you can see just a little bit more of what's going on. Nice, James. Nice. Let's turn that off. Are you doing alright this evening? Are you enjoying the stream? It's only bloody... Um, it's only 20 past 9. We've still got loads of train time to do. Like I say, this is the last stream for a week. I've got a few shorts coming up. That I've queued up. Nothing special. Um, nothing that you probably haven't seen before. But it keeps the channel busy with a daily upload of some sort. So if you want to give that any attention, maybe a little cheeky like or a comment, hey, you know, I would appreciate that. But yeah, at least uh, I'll try that this time rather than just making the channel go dead for a week. You went to see the Spice Girls at Murrayfield. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Christopher. I'm sorry to hear that. Who was you expecting there when you turned up? <laughs> I'll tell you what I want right over fuck off. Jerry Horner. Oh, God. Oh. Wow, wow, wow. I mean, let's be honest. Jerry was the only sort of... Uh, I don't want to use the word shaggable because that seems a little bit derogatory, but... <laughs> She was the only shaggable one, and look at her now. It says so much, doesn't it? <laughs> I don't want to use that term, because that's, that's wrong, isn't it? <laughs> All right, Copa T, don't shout. <laughs> Michael. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Right, we're going via the location. We've got a green. Everything's fine. Victoria. Oh, come on. Really, Tace? With that miserable face. That just never smiles. Oh, God. <laughs> As if she died in battle. <laughs> No, none of them were for me. Some of the songs were right, some were quite catchy, but no. 
God, at one time they were rammed down our down our throat as the media, wasn't they? They were everywhere. Yeah, Mel B is quite pretty. Yeah, how the fuck did she have a baby with Eddie Murphy? How did that even happen? How the fuck does that happen? How does one go about that? <laughs> I would have given her something to smile about. You, what, you'd have told her some of my jokes? <laughs> oh, God. You'd, you'd have done some of my impressions like that. I don't really know. Then she'd be laughing. But, you know, what can you say? Oh, God, the bow selector. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> a cream egg <laughs> yeah have you been to york before i think i have james yeah yeah i have uh yeah yeah i have i think emma bunton was the prettiest yeah you're probably right there yeah yeah let's let's use a, a, at least a decent term we don't have to go like and it you know unmolested cream egg i'm gonna get it all on me finger and you're gonna watch me all oh, the numbers will go up then, won't they? <laughs> this is nice, isn't it? Look, look at that. Oh, my good God. Is this a, a Rivet game one? I think it is, isn't it? Oh, look at that. That looks really nice. Oh, they've got the old static grass applicator there, Taste that. <laughs> Multiplayer would go, would be good, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I haven't been to the railway museum. Yeah, yes, yeah, rivet. Yeah. Oh, this is very nice. <laughs> Wank. <laughs> yeah that looks uh, very nice looks detailed doesn't it it looks detailed in a less is more way and when you're modelling sometimes less is more less is way more actually wanker it's the wanker horn Oh, I've got you. Is it still open, though, AC? Let's stretch her legs a little bit. <laughs> it was a real... Oh, God, can you imagine it as a real one? <laughs> oh, God. There's no answer. I think my wife has gone down the shop. I really genuinely do. That would be amazing, wouldn't it? Like I say, it's the beauty of doing it in front of 170 people. How can you realistically say no? It's pressurising, isn't it? That's what it is. <laughs> totally free as well, is it really? Because they've got the turntable in the middle, haven't they? With the... Um, did they have the Mallard, the, the Flying Scotsman, a couple of others? Have they got that there? Is that the one I'm thinking of? Do you reckon it's hard being a train driver? Well, with training, everything is approachable, isn't it? Of course, it's going to be hard. If you were just told to sit in a train and make it go, you probably wouldn't. But as with anything, you don't know unless you're shown. So once you're shown and once you're learned, and, you know, is it hard? No. It's just a skill that you've uh, um, that you build up. You wouldn't do that, Scott. Not so I could hear it anyway. Ha 
hand should appear with a pair of lovely wrap cream in it. I really hope so, because I really want one now. Oh, lovely, I see. Yeah, I think we need to do that then. No help. Two hours trying to move forward. Yeah. Yeah. It does happen. It's usually user error. So you're better off just restarting and reading it again, reading it slower. That's what I find, and it's fine. The light in here is really good, isn't it? Really good. Those crossings scare the life out of me. They really do. <laughs> Jay should do the wanker inside and out. Oh shit, no, this, right, let's go via, hang on, hang on, slow the f This is a go via location, okay. Let's have a little cheeky look. I do like to try and give you the best shots possible. <gasps> Here we go! Look at this! Look at this! Oh my god, I don't care that I'm speeding either. Okay, maybe I'll do a little bit. Right, here we go. Yes. Oh, what a beautiful bridge. Yeah, yeah, we drove across that. That's right. Yeah, there's three or four bridges all, all together here. Oh, sh oh, shit. It's fine. I don't know what else I pressed then, but... It's fine. Yeah, we drove across this. Yes, we did. No, we didn't drive across this. We drove across that one, and we looked to the right and saw this. Oh, look at the train. That gives you... That's a really good sense of scale, though, isn't it? That's a fantastic sense of scale. Look how little the train is. That's really cool. Right, I fucked up. I just pressed anything, I think. Yeah, I just pressed anything. Really cool. I mean, as a f as a feat of engineering, to get it in game is pretty cool. That's really good. The sense of scale has struck me there. How small the train is. Can we see up it? Can we have a look up it? For some reason, I thought that that would there would be holes in that, so you could see through. Don't know why. What sort of? Hmm. No. Right, stop at location. Okay. It was a little bit too soon, Derek. There are people dead, but, you know, if you can't laugh in life, I don't know, what can you? I don't know. I don't know what can you do, but, yeah. Beautiful attention to detail. Stun it. Oh, look at this. Oh, that is cool. Because obviously this will be here in real life. That looks cool. Oh, I do need to do this journey again because it was quite spectacular. I think that's the word. I wouldn't use spectacular to describe whales. I love whales. I genuinely adore whales. I want to move there. I really do. But I don't think I would describe whales as spectacular. Like stunning. It's, it's just beautiful. But when I went to... Scotland, some of it is spectacular, like truly fucking like outrageous scenery. Yeah. <clears throat> Looking up things for an owl. <laughs> I tell you what I want what I really, really want is a Cadbury's cream egg, yeah. You gotta wait for these fuckers to take pictures. I'll hurry out, will ya? Come on. Can we go over here? I don't know which one I drove on because there's two. Yeah, I don't know, I can't remember. Did I look to the right and see two bridges? Or was I in the middle? I can't remember. I mean... Oh, I can hear a ship. Can I? Ha! <laughs> it's Max's guitar. <laughs> I thought I could hear like a foghorn type thing. It's Max's guitar, it's fine. Oh, see you later, British Ace. Thanks, mate. Thanks for coming in. Yeah, I mean, you only have to look at something like this, right? 
to 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 know that video games are just quite stunning at times that is really fucking good just that as a shot just that as a shot is fan fucking tastic that's a beautiful shot just there a bit of the castle the fort in there a little bit more train yeah we'll have that Yeah, yeah, absolutely, AC, yeah, yeah, some of the coves, some of the hidden things that you've got to walk down, and then suddenly you're there, and it used to be like an old smuggling thing, and there's still the cranes there, and not like, like, you know, um, current cranes, like, you know, wooden and metal versions, still there, and you're just down, and you've got these fucking caves and these mountains around you, so cool, yeah, just really cool. Is it nice taste? Yeah, I bet it is. But this is this is probably this is one of the nicest bridges and one of the nicest scenes I think I've ever seen in a video game. I'm not joking. It's really good. What what do you think? Do you think I've I've given that a bit much? I mean look at it, look. Look at the light in the way the light's coming off the That's really cool. But even from the cab view, it just looks really cool. Yeah, love it. Enjoy your evening shit in real life trains. Yeah, I mean, you know, you can go at the station before you get on the train. It's up to you. It does look really good. It does look spectacular, yeah. Yeah, it really does. Oh, what would it look like from, from there? That's good as well, isn't it? Look at that. That's cool. Cool. Oh, are you? Oh, nice, George. Yeah, traitors. That was cool. Lovely castle. Oh, look at that. That ironwork there is just. That's really cool. Now, am am I am I con am I um complimenting the game or the bridge? Because the bridge looks fucking stunning. Look at that. It really does. Absolutely stunning. Oh, what? You haven't. Oh, got tea. And a dog. Oh, get in there. Oh, you're an angel. Look, do you remember this? Do you remember that? It's the bridge, wasn't it, in Scotland, when we drove over and there was bridges all around us. Look at that. Come here. Give, give me a hand. <laughs> Thank you, darling. You're an angel. Thanks, babe. Oh, look at that. Cassie doesn't deserve you. I know. Look, look. I've got both. Unbelievable. And I've got a doggy as well. Hello, Eva. I know. I'm a very lucky sod. Right, we've got to stop here. Okay. She is the best. She is. So if you ever want a yes to a question, just try and get 150 people together. <laughs> Makes it a lot easier. This is why people do the whole, um, like, oh, will you marry me in front of a football stadium? Who's going to say no? They'll say no later, maybe, but at the time, it's like, how do I get a yes? That's what it is, isn't it? That's what they're doing. Oh, Derek, I don't know nothing about that, mate, to be honest with you. Yeah. All right, let's get this cream egg done. I'm afraid, Eva, this is a no. Is the person that asked what a cream egg is, is is, is he or she still here? Because I can show you, if not. Oh, I've gone off him now. I don't really fancy him now. <laughs> I'm joking. I really do fancy him. Oh, God, you're going to... I'm going to be licking the middle and everything. It's going to be awesome. All right, numbers will go up now. I hope she has a world's best wife mug in the cupboard. I don't think she has, actually. Mm. Oh, look at this. Look at this. That's really cool. Bloody hell. That's, that's really good. Yeah. 
He's going to tongue a cream egg live. No, I'm not going to do anything rude. Save it for the OnlyFans. Yeah. I mean, you can't just give that shit away, can you? I think this might go down as the prettiest route uh, on Train Sim that I've played. What, what do you think? I think a lot of that is just generally the location. It's a beautiful location. Oh, very nice bridge. Look at that. Look at that. That's really cool. They've really utilised the um, the pillars, haven't they? For the extra weight. One minute pause for tourist photos. Nice. I'm not going to finger nothing. I'm just going to eat it in a normal way. It's making me want to play the game so I can play this route. Yeah, it's very, very nice. There, there we go. There's the egg. And uh, I'll, I'll go off cam for this. Just, just talk amongst yourselves, all right? Mm. Oh, off. <laughs> oh, it's lovely, though. Mmm. <laughs> Can we have you full screen? Mmm. Oh, sweetheart. It's when I start slurping you got to worry. Just as you imagine, yeah, probably better. Yeah. Mm. I'm going down. <laughs> oh, this is too much. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I know. <laughs> Don't be rude. <laughs> no, I'm I'm off camera. I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm down here doing it. I'm not even on camera. Look, I've gone down. Mm. Oh, what? What? <laughs> <laughs> mm. Right. <laughs> she opened the door and went, Don't be rude, otherwise I wouldn't have got him. <laughs> right. Let's go. That's the life. It is. It is. Well, she said, Don't be rude, otherwise I wouldn't have got him for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at this. Mm. For the night, I think that that was that will store away for a week, wouldn't it, Jake? Oh, that's nice. Yeah, let's not be rude. That was too much, wasn't it? The original Cadbury, yeah, Cadbury's cream egg, yeah. Although it's not Cadbury's chocolate, is it? Oh, now I'm thinking two might be too many. But we, we started, we've got to carry on, haven't we? Mmm. There we go. Oh, I like this little bridge. Or girder. Look at that. Oh, wow. Mmm. Mmm. I didn't make her, Christine. I just asked really, really nicely via phone. And being such a lovely bird, she said, all right. But then she warned me and said, if I'd known you were going to make rude noises with them, I wouldn't have got them. <laughs> I'm like, do you know me? And 150 people watching, yeah. Right, it's, the whole thing's going in, so it'll be a while until I can talk to you, okay? Hmm. <laughs> right, I'm just able to start talking again. <laughs> what a man. I didn't complain. Does the filling actually have flavour? It's just sweet. 
Yeah, it's just sweet. I demolished them, didn't I? There's no fucking about there. Now, the real wife test is can I have two more? <laughs> now, as a flavour, yeah, but uh, yeah, you don't want any more than two. Probably one was enough, really. One and a milky bar might have been a better choice. That was beautiful. Thank you, Kaz, if you're listening and wondering if I'm still being filthy. Hello, Eva. What are you doing now? Yeah, one's enough. Oh, you're a good girl. Come around this side. Come around here. Let's, let's say hello to Eva. Oh. Eva. Hello. Look <laughs> over her headset wire. Hello, what are you doing? On here. On here. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, she's stretching. Oh, yeah. Come here. Why are you licking the, the switch? Come here. Oh, look at her. Look, she's beautiful. Yeah, you are. Look at her little eyes. Look. Yeah, you are beautiful. You are. Such a good girl. Yeah, you're a good baby, but you cannot have chocolate. It makes bum bisto. I've told you this, and you know this. We've done this before. You accidentally had some chocolate, and I spent the next two days tidying up. Yeah, it wasn't good. She's looking for the third egg, yeah. Oh, you're such a good girl. <laughs> She's nuzzling my hand. Come on, Dad. Just let me have the experience of one chocolate. Oh, sorry to hear that, Gary. Sorry, mate. Yeah. My thoughts are with you and your family, Gary. <laughs> oh, God's good, Scud, can you imagine? Right, let's get sped up, because we're just doing absolutely nothing here. God, look at that lighting on the side. Look at that. Oh, God, look, the reflection on the window. <laughs> look at that reflection as we go up and down on the light. Whoa! <laughs> the glass is really cool, isn't it? What's the knob on my keyboard, upper right? Probably the volume. Is this the last station? Is this the last station, last photo? What do you mean? Chocolate is poisonous for dogs, yeah. Not poison enough to kill them, like if they had a little bit, but it upset her tummy. To the point where we called it bum bisto. I'll leave that to your imagination. Or Max come up with bum gravy, yeah. Yeah, I wasn't worried about it. It just upsets their tummy. You'd have to keep giving them a lot of chocolate before um, you'd poison them. Yeah, that's all right, Gary. You you know you're welcome here anytime. We all go through things, don't we? We all go through it. Can you hear Max and his guitar? He's doing so well with his guitar. Fucking hell. My green guitar that was hanging for about a year behind the rig. Oh, I've got a guitar. Never touched it. He's gone. He's gone up there and he's absolutely smashing it. He goes to this music like uh, like a youth music club thing on a Thursday, and uh, like they've just made a song up. Sounds really good. He's playing um, drums on it, doing guitar and doing singing as well. It's really good. Get him down for a performance. He probably would. The thing is, it kept making the mic cut out. Do you remember? I don't know whether that was more to do with... Um, uh, what was the program we used? Like, not Teams. Uh, you know, like the Microsoft thing. Uh, Zoom. Yeah. Probably more to do with Zoom. Uh, with Zoom. Hello, Andy C. Oh, nice bit of graffiti there. Is it? 
That's a weird bit patch of graffiti. Hmm, not sure about that one. Yeah, I think Zoom cuts out too much noise. It, 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 it was all sounding weird, wasn't it? This is a beautiful room. A little bit of pop up there, but that's probably my PC more than anything else. It does need quite a beefy PC to run it with, you know, 4K with no pop in. Especially when, like, there's such a long um, distance ahead of you. <laughs> nice bit of detail there. Cool. <laughs> cool, isn't it? See you later, boss. Right, what we got here, 1.8, we're stopping. How are you, David Finney? What are your impressions of the route? Um, I don't really do that many impressions. I do... Um, I do <laughs> That's not what you meant, was it? I like the route. Oh, bloody hell, I'm going really fast. Yeah, route looks good. Very picturesque. <laughs> what are your impressions? I can reel them off on one hand. Right. I don't do Alan Partridge. Aha! <laughs> <laughs> I could probably work on it, but I can't do it for you right now. So many lakes. So much water up in Scotland, isn't there? So many lakes. So many locks. It's really, really wet, isn't it? Right, we're stopping here. Twat. <laughs> oi, oi. Not everything's rude claimed. Come on. But yeah, oi, oi. <laughs> it's never done raining, yeah. Well, you've got so much water up there, I suppose it, it just creates that sort of atmosphere, isn't it? Oh, look at that. That looks so good. It's like when you come to Scotland or, or Wales, it's like you can breathe. Do you know what I mean? It's like, look how open that is. You can actually take a breath. That's how I felt in Scotland anyway. And when I go to Wales, it feels like you can like you can actually breathe. Does that make any sense? I mean, oh, that's lovely. Look at that. That's really cool. Right, while they're taking a picture, I'm going to nip to the little boy's room. Two seconds, I'll be back.
Right, here we go. Oh, bloody hell. Did you take your pictures of the scenery while I was gone? Right. Let's go. <laughs> sure she's back you wash her so there was no more there was no more messages right here we go 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 Matt <laughs> looks cool doesn't it oh even the way they faded in like the water with the beach look <coughs> Yeah, good night, Tracy. Have a lovely um, Easter with your family. Oh, that's a nice shot, isn't it? <laughs> Beach review. I mean, you're, you live up there, don't you, um, Christine? Do you think you utilise the beauty of where you live enough? Or do you not take it for granted, but you you don't utilise it as much as you could or should? Because I feel if I lived up here every weekend, I'd just want to go and look at something new. The chances of me actually doing that are very slim, because you get bogged down with life and work. But it feels like the sort of place where it's like Saturday morning, right, what are we going to look at today? Come on, we can't, we need to get out there. <clears throat> Hello, Romeo, how are you, mate? Oh, it looks shocking last Thursday. Did it really taste? Wow. Only 45 minutes from those views in most directions, yeah. You gotta get in your mini and go out, and you. That's good, Romeo. You're up late, and you. Your granddad said you were seven, I think, didn't he? It's ten o'clock at night. What's going on, Romeo? You'll be so tired in the morning. <laughs> right, let's keep it nice now. Let's keep it clean. I suppose that's what summer's for, and in the winter you sort of hibernate, don't you? And then suddenly the sun hits, and you're like, right, we need to get out. You can be so tired tomorrow, Romeo. I can see it now. Yeah, more, so do we sometimes. Actually, tell a lie. It's been a long time since I've been up at 5 o'clock gaming. Last time I was up at 5 o'clock gaming, I was doing a 24-hour stream. Oh, look at all this. Look at that. Wow. What do you think of this, Romeo? You like a bit of train sim? <laughs> this is fantastic. It is good, yeah. Just trying to get a nice shot as it goes past. That's it, like that. Beautiful. <coughs> is it worth the money? Um if you've got to buy the whole ecosystem then obviously you've you know that's quite a it's quite a purchase isn't it but at the same time yes you get the truck mount you tilt it up you've got the size you've got all the different colored buttons on top you, you're doing it at the right angle yeah i've had a great experience with it really great um but yeah it's a lot of money isn't it yeah i think it is much yeah That's it, that's a nice shot. <laughs> from prison. 
working. <laughs> yeah, I've seen all them. Um, I've seen all them TikToks where you upload all your videos from the prison cell. I've seen it. I've seen it. You're all like all spiced up, all like that. <laughs> what are you doing in the prison, Roberto? <coughs> Have you uh, also heard any more on the new Turtle Beach? I've watched a couple of reviews and it's um, a apparently nothing to write home about, but with some possible fixes to software might fix it. Yeah. Oh, nice para, nice. Yeah, but, you know, is it worth it? If you do a lot of trucking, um, you've got some extra spare change that you want to sort of invest in your hobby then yeah it's worth it it's a lovely will what base would you go with or have you already got a moser base i mean if you've already got the moser base then of course the trucking rim's worth it hello will how are you This is cool. I like the idea of like this stopping um, thing. You know, let them take pictures. You're not got any wheel or base combo, yeah. Uh, do you do sim racing, or are you just more interested in the trucking aspect of it all? Yeah, lovely wheel. Thank you very much. I think if you enter the trucking side of things more than sim racing, you could just go with the lowest Moser base. It's still going to be more than your average Thrustmaster or um, Logitech anyway. The base pedals are fine. I use them and I'm sim racing. Absolutely fine. Um, yeah. You went with the R12. Yeah. Yeah. It really is, Scud. It's a beauty. Yeah, even the cheap base, you'll be absolutely fine, and it—I mean, it's direct drive. It'll be above Thrustmaster and Logitech. At the drop-in on last stream before um, Jace's court appearance next week. Sorry, holiday. <laughs> it's when I'm off for three months. You got to worry, Colonel. How are you, mate? You still down in Cornwall? Yeah, the R9. Yeah, ideally you'd want to get the um, the truck mount as well. Is that where you would have it on a desk or on a rig? <coughs> Probably claimed, yeah. yeah. No, you can only walk so far away. It's got like a perimeter that you can take the camera um, and walk. Oh, we're stopping here. Oh, I'm just too good tonight, aren't I? Look at this. Play seat rig, yeah. Almost 900, I could buy an actual car for that, yeah. Well, funnily enough, we were having this conversation, like, it's hobby grade stuff, isn't it? So if, uh, uh, you know, um, if he wants to buy it, then why can't you treat yourself? It's not you. You can't rate every purchase on what else you could get for that money. Otherwise, you'd never buy anything. Mortz and myself were talking about the, um, you know, the model cars that you buy monthly on a magazine, and you end up with this spectacular metal, heavy, really detailed thing. I worked it out. It was coming to about sixteen hundred pound um, for a model car. That's crazy. If that's what you want to do, then that's what you want to do. Why Why can't you do it? Fuck it. It doesn't matter. You can't say, oh, I better not do that because I could buy a car for that. That's just not how it works, is it? You buy the stuff that you're interested in. It's like saying, well, you know, <laughs> I can't have a McDonald's because I could buy shopping with that. It's, that's how life works, isn't it? You gave me a cheeky one. Thank you, Ro uh, Romeo. Thank you, mate. Model railways cost a bomb. Oh, God, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't just say, well, I can't buy a loco because I could buy a week shopping with that. It's not, that's not living, is it? You know, it's not living. If you're into something, then you get your money out of your pocket and you, you buy it and you enjoy it. And you've still got the product. If you stop enjoying it, you can sell it and get half your money back. 
yeah, you can't treat life like that, really, can you? Especially where hobbies are involved, because hobbies, hobbies are what get you through tough days, tough nights, tough periods, and you just enjoy it. And it's worth buying things to, for that. That's why you know we buy these things. Yeah, you do have a place seat, but I'm looking for a steering wheel set up for trucking and racing. Yeah, well, that would do it. And with the place seat, you could put the um, Watch my video because you could put the clamp on where your steering wheel would actually go and then tilt it. You could do it that way. Uh, but I'd say just watch the videos and streams that I've done so far and make sure that it could fit your sort of angle. Yeah. <laughs> it was more of a Jason's MJ impression. <laughs> <laughs> you can only compare to how many cream eggs you can get for that amount of money. I know. But Barefoot, if you do decide, I'd love it if you click my link before you went to purchase and they'll send the channel a little commission. But other than that, um, just watch the videos and make sure that it would fit what you're after. But in terms of the actual product, I can't think of anything wrong with Moza apart from it's not going to be console compatible, it is just PC. Um, so as long as you know that, then you know that, don't you? Exactly, you only live once, you can't take it with you, yeah. Like, who the fuck wants to build a model car? Who? What good does it do in life? It's, it's pathetic, isn't it? It's just a fucking model car. No, that's not just how life works, is it? It's not. It's so much more than that. It's the... The one thing that I liked about doing the monthly thing, it almost brought me back to childhood. Like, everything we get now, we, we just... We almost click our fingers and we go and get it, don't we? Um... Not everything expensive, just anything. Well, when, you, when you're a kid, you have to wait for things. And I did like that aspect of waiting each month for a new part, a new story in the magazine, and then connecting that up to the rest of the model, and then waiting another month. I really like that aspect of it. But when I spoke to them, they were saying, oh, sometimes we're going to send you four magazines at once. That's so going to be like 50 quid out of your bank. I was like, oh, I don't mind committing to 11 99 a month, even if it is for like 100 years. But I don't want you to start taking like six issues out of the bank and suddenly, what's that? Oh, 70 quid, two years in. Oh, bloody hell. You know, I was happy committing to one, but when they started to say that, it just confused me a little bit. And I said to them, mm, I'd like to cancel actually because I did pre order it. <laughs> yeah, building the DeLorean got me through lockdown. Exactly. Oh, three miles, we're not stopping yet. To stop myself from going down on a YouTube rabbit hole, spending a fortune and then realising it's not for you, yeah. I don't buy anything unless I realise it's not for me. Yeah. And YouTube is great for that. You can watch other people, their reactions. And you don't just watch one person, you watch lots of people. So you watch someone like me that got, say, the Moser stuff sent for free. Okay, that's fine. Then you take another video where the bloke brought it with his own harder money. What does he also think of it? And you just, you know, the official stuff, you watch that as well. Same with anything. If you're going to buy a remote control car, you'd, you'd watch the official stuff. Then you'd watch a influencer and what he thinks of it. Then you'd go to a man that has actually paid for it and, and wants to look after it. And, it, you know, you get all these different opinions. You can do that on YouTube, can't you? It's great. Is this new route worth buying, bro? It's certainly got the best scenery. Yeah, and it feels like you're on on a, on holiday. <laughs> That's what it feels like. Yeah, it's very very nice. And the uh, the bridge. Oh my god, the fourth bridge was absolutely beautiful. I want to do that again. Would you be able to use that steering wheel for racing, like the position of the wheel? Well, you could do. You could do. But the thing is. In the position it's in at the moment, I've got to have two positions on my rig, one for racing, one for trucking. The one for trucking is a lot further down and tipped back. You couldn't really do racing in that position unless you were doing truck racing. With the position as it is at the moment for sim racing, it's a lot higher and a lot pointed to me. So the steering wheel actually hits my leg because the steering wheel's massive. It's the same size as a proper truck. So there, if you're sim racing or trucking, just bear in mind you are going to be moving between two setups or two angles really yeah <laughs> yeah bro sorry <laughs> it's 400 millimeters yeah it's a full-size trucking rim so if you've got your sim racing nice and tucked in like this like this and suddenly like it, it's like that 
and if it gets wider it also gets wider on your legs as well i couldn't do trucking in the position it's in i have to move it back down so yeah you're just gonna have to make your mind up if that's something you can do in your rig or maybe you'll have the trucking stuff at the desk i loved it on the desk i really did i like i like trucking up here although i've got it set up there and it will always be set up there i did like trucking in my chair it felt like a trucking chair it was quite high i could get the correct angle almost like a flat angle for trucking that was really good yeah <clears throat> yeah graphics are lovely yeah yeah they really are i quite like the pace of it all as well it's quite quite chilled isn't it Forty months because you missed the member stream, but you won the members giveaway. Oh hello! Oh my good god! Look at this! Look at that! That's oh look at that for a shot! Oh my good god! <laughs> That's oh, oh there's a bloody pitch on the other side as well. Oh and the running area as well. That's really cool. Look at this! Yeah, this is the best. The best uh, sort of scene on on train sim absolutely no we don't really like fortnite romeo i'm sure a lot of people play it here but i don't that's romeo he's only seven and he's um uh roderick's grandson <laughs> yeah they probably do actually i see yeah Well, some of these um some of these trees are over quite a bit <laughs> where for up now I tell you what my train driving though has been absolutely spot on tonight come on Come on, credit where credit's due. Please have your How you getting on with Grand Tour 7? Grand Turismo 7? Haven't played it for ages. Can't, I can't play it at the moment because I haven't got a steering wheel that works with it. <laughs> That's alright, right, man. Is your granddad still there, Romeo? Because don't forget, I, sometimes game text says naughty words. I don't want to upset anyone. A lot of the time he says naughty words, which I know you've heard before watching the stream. I know that. That's going to be a nice shot down here. Oh, yeah, that's going to be cool. Too small of a screen. Yeah, love the big screen while driving. Yeah, yeah. This has been lovely tonight. What's the time? What's the time? It's uh, 10 o'clock. Let's have a look. All good. That's fine. <laughs> Don't listen to the nasty man. 10.09, yeah. All right. <laughs> don't listen to the nasty man. You mean don't listen to Colonel? Oh, I wanted to watch it go past. Ah, oh. for a train sim if I'm driving a lot in real life. Yeah, that was good. Oh, I got the old red speed in. Lovely, hard impact. Cool. Uh, should we do the? Let's do the next scenario. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. If it takes about an hour, this might be the last scenario. But I started an hour earlier as well. All good. Not saying a word. It's very early morning. You've been sent to recover a recently repaired train that had broken down the previous night and started fresh at the Mark Inch to, Ed Mark Inch to Edinburgh Waverley route. Oh, we might see Waverley. Lucky for you, the ride... <laughs> It never stays up long enough, does it? Lucky for you. Right, we'll take that away. Oh, 
Oh, thanks, Douglas. Thanks, mate. Here we go. Bosh. One out of 25. Take a seat in any passenger seat. Oh, that's going to be good. Just sitting there doing that. I don't think they do that enough, actually. Yeah, it is train sim. But sometimes just sitting looking out the window is just awesome. The best YouTube channel, you said, Colonel. Right, let's sit down. Let's find someone to annoy. There we go. We're sitting that one. Ah, oh, that's it. That's it. We're sitting all on our own. We're a single passenger, but we're going to take up the four because that's the thing to do, isn't it? Of course it is. Or if I've got a suitcase, I might put the suitcase on the chair. That's that's the thing, isn't it? You don't put it up there. You put it there as if it's a paid passenger. Lovely. Especially with this. Look at the rain. Look. The phone on loudspeaker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, did not print out. I meant the best, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you got to have someone watching YouTube loud. I mean, I don't mind if it's me, obviously. And you don't want to say anything this day and age, do you? Because there'll be fisticuffs. Does your granddad know that you're still in my stream, Romeo? I'm just asking. You're not in trouble. I'm just asking. Right, here we go. Oh, it's just so cool, and it? it's such an accomplished video game. Imagine this years ago. Oh god, you, you couldn't have imagined it. You couldn't have dreamed that this would be available one day. <coughs> Hello, Billy. Billy Fry up, how are you? Yeah, 2007 he had his last fry up. It's cool in the rain, it just adds another... Oh, there's the bridges, look! Oh, that means we're going across the fourth bridge now, doesn't it? Cool, and I haven't got a choice. We can't look outside, so we're just going to enjoy it from here. Even the sound, though, just everything is spot on. Hello, Thomas. Douglas, thank you, mate. Daniel Short got it. You're going to bed. Good night, Romeo. Here we go. Here it is. That Douglas, thank you very much, mate. I appreciate that. It would be good if this was multiplayer and we could all sit in a carriage, couldn't it? That would be good. Wow, we're actually going over the fourth bridge, but it's annoying because you can't see it, isn't it? It's be is it better to be on this bridge and looking out or to be on the normal bridge looking at this bridge? Yeah. You didn't miss anything, Billy. Yeah, nothing happened. Yeah. You're right. You're right. I messed up. I know. And you tried to tell me as well, didn't you? You did try and tell me. That's it. You did try and tell me. Look at that. Look, it just looks so good. That's alright, Thomas. I love streaming. You got what, Jason? What's up, Daniel? Well, you what, mate? You what? <laughs> oh, Colonel done it. Thank you very much. And Billy Fry up, his last fry up was 2007. He's only gone and got it, hasn't he? <laughs> You stream while you're having your spag bowl. Thank you, Colonel. I appreciate that. Thank you. Don't give your voucher back. Oh, look at this down here. Look. Cool. Oh, this is just so good. I'm always like this when I play Train Sim. I'm like, oh, I should play it more. In a funny kind of way, I like the way that I play it sort of every three months because I just come in and it's just so good to play. I think if I played or streamed it every week, it'd be like, oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, it does that. But I'm always so impressed, it's almost like the first time I, I play it. It's great. Can you can I ask what your train sim top three DLC? Oh Marky. Well this is up there number one. Then the London to Brighton, that's absolutely up there. And probably the Isle of White. Yeah. Yeah, I think that would be it. 
What is a membership? Thank you so much. Membership is just, uh, you, you, well, you've been a member before, Daniel. Uh, oh, was it a membership? Thank you. Yeah, Daniel. Yeah. Yeah. You know what a membership is. You've got a GT UK badge rather than news. You know what it is. Which route do you think is best? This one or London o Overground? Probably this one. But again, it, the thing is, like, you buy the bits that you fancy, you know. Yeah, you buy the bits that you want. It looks like the train is a big 55-inch TV showing, yeah. <laughs> exactly like that. There he is, he's there. They, they've given in to public demand. The train wants it playing. All the old, st all the old streams, all the really, really sweary ones. See it, say it, watch it. That's it. Beautiful. Yeah, they should definitely do that more, where you can just uh, just ride as part of your scenario. Look at it, that. Since when did we get adverts during live stream? Well, that's YouTube. They just chuck them in there, don't they? Hello, Baz. How are you? I remember one one year I had COVID. It was the first time I was really suffering. And what? what uh, uh, Creek Crane Creek. What's it called? Creek, um, Crane Creek, I think it's called. I just couldn't do it. I just couldn't do it. Oh, God. It, I was falling apart in that stream. It's still on the channel. I, I'd just been diagnosed with COVID, and I was like, right, we'll stream. And I was just going downhill rapidly. Oh, God, I couldn't control the train. It kept running back down the hill. Oh, God. Have you been getting loads of adverts? Oh, it should just be on the standard, like, con I've, I've actually told it to be conservative. Yeah. Sorry, Daniel. <coughs> oh, where's this? Where's this? <laughs> what the fuck? Shut the door and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Oh good, yeah. Can you imagine that? Shut the door, and, they, and the person leaving wouldn't know who said it. They'd look around, like, yeah, the the, sh the door shuts by itself. Oh God, will yeah, yeah, yeah. I had COVID, and I was just, I was just more and more falling apart. I think I had a week off after that stream. <laughs> oh, it's, doesn't it change YouTube, Chrissy? Oh my God. Oh, I'm sorry if you've been getting a load of adverts. I haven't, like, it's literally set to uh, conservative, yeah. Because they're going to put them on anyway. So, look, monetize, I know you can't see it. Yeah, conservative, yeah. Which means, uh, yeah, in their language, less money, better viewer experience. Well, that's what I want. It is, it changes YouTube so much. It really does. The, you know, think about it. it, it like, what, what's more valuable than time? So if you enjoy the website, which I do, I'm always on YouTube. Before every video, you've got to watch the first fucking 20 seconds of a thing before you put skip. It gets rid of all that. You just don't have to think about it anymore. It's really good. Yeah. Subscribe to YouTube, then no adverts. Yeah, yeah. It, YouTube without adverts is how YouTube should be. Yeah, and and the the adverts are getting crazy. Sometimes you get two in a row, don't you? And it's just like for fuck's sake. Yeah, but just to be clear, I know Will's put that up. Being becoming a channel member won't change adverts. That that's separate. They give you more adverts to suck in. Yeah, I only tried it. Oh, I don't know about a year ago. I, I just wouldn't go back. The only time I'll ever cancel that is if I stop watching YouTube for some reason. Which I can't see because I watch YouTube more than I watch anything. Best website in the world, isn't it? Let's be honest. Or the best app in the world. Because the app is what you make it. You watch what you want to watch. So it's perfect TV channel. You don't mind ads on anything else, yeah? Well, ads on TV give you a chance to go out and get more snacks, don't it? Or more eggs or something, you know? Douglas, welcome back, mate. You've been a member before, haven't you? Thank you, uh, Douglas. I can only eat meals watching a YouTube video. 
I, I think I think I am addicted to YouTube to a certain extent. Like if I'm tidying up, I put a podcast on, or you know, like a, I, I like interviews. I like interviews. I like listening to people. I like people's opinions. I like learning something from people. So I like I put on all sorts of podcasters. You know the ones, you know, Diary of a CEO, um, uh, James English, uh, Sean Atwoods. I like true crime, so I like all that gangster shit. And I just put that on while I'm having doing some jobs around the house, or yeah, yeah, I just watch it all the time. And they charge you twelve ninety nine. Not everyone can afford that. Uh, that's right. That's why there's a choice whether you buy it or not. That, again, that's life, isn't it? You either want it or you don't. That that's life, isn't it? Yeah, that's how life should work. If you want something, you pay for it. But if you don't want it or you can't afford it, there should also be a, a choice. And there is. You can have exactly the same website just with adverts. It's fine, isn't it? Sim wrote any podcast. I like li I like listening to people. Yeah, I like listening to people talk. I, I you know, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I didn't realise there was anything else on YouTube apart from this. I don't watch gaming streams or anything like that because, well, we've we've spoken about that. But yeah, I don't watch anything gaming, not really. But I do like um, podcasts or um, long interviews. Oh, I love seeing an interview with someone that I might might be interested in or might it might even not. It might just be like I like the the person who's asking the questions. It doesn't mean that I necessarily like the other person or even know the other person. But there's nothing better than seeing an hour and a half chat. And I think, oh, fucking lovely. I might watch it over three or four days. Yeah, it's cool. I do get a, um, a message from YouTube, like your YouTube, YouTube roundup, how much hours you've watched. I don't open it. I don't open it. Yeah. Twitch gets adverts. Yeah, of course, because the website needs paying for. You know, they don't look at look at the facility. Like, I run a business in real life, as many people here do. Um, I can't move without being charged money. Oh, you've got to do that. You've got to, you know, oh, the rent, the rates, the, everything. And yet, people expect a website like this, you know, just to be free. It's crazy, really. Imagine the amount of infrastructure and staff behind this. And he's painful. Yeah. Yeah, Joe Rogan, yeah. You got a YouTube manager? Have I got one? No, absolutely not. No, no. I'm only a tiny channel for that. Yeah, just tiny. <coughs> 140 watching in terms of the world of YouTube. That's minuscule, but it's important to me. But no, I haven't got a YouTube manager or anyone at YouTube I could even speak to. No. You do get free music as well. Yeah, yeah. God, this is a long start, isn't it? This one. Bloody hell. I don't want a manager anyway. I'm the fucking manager. Yeah, I don't have a manager. <laughs> Can't imagine YouTube. I know, and there's so many hours uploaded every second to YouTube. What? what? I don't get it in a way. I don't, oh, yeah, yeah. But yeah, this website needs paying for. I don't want this website to go anywhere. So I'm quite happy paying premium to support them. Or if not, I'll, you know take part in the adverts it needs paying for yeah oh thank you Lewis if and when the summer goes you're going to do your track days again nah that was a one off yeah that was a one off just a one off I love me car too much and it's getting on a bit now I don't want to take it there excuse me Mr Influencer where's your streaming schedule I don't have a schedule yeah because I'm the manager and the manager says he don't want one <laughs> the manager says if you feel like streaming stream if you don't don't because that's the best way you're going to get best streams isn't it what you got planned for games next week nothing Andrew I'm not here next week my manager's giving me a week off <laughs> it's half term I disappear half term because it's family time everyone's home uh, my missus is home it's lovely Yeah, I like having a manager now. <laughs> this is a really long intro to the scenario, isn't it? There was me like, oh, I love it. And now I'm like, come on, get there. Uh, 
Outlast, yeah, I love Outlast, yeah. Mortz can come and help me. That was fun, actually. I liked it when Mortz got into the chat, because that's when we started to work together. Still didn't do it, though, did we? <laughs> that is true, Barefoot, but, you know, R Factor 2, you can pretty much uh, um, reimagine it in R Factor 2. <laughs> click it, click it, tick clack. You thinking about? Uh, think you are getting off at a stop after the next one? Oh, I got you. Okay, cool. Yeah, because we're going up to Waverley, aren't we? It's <laughs> such a cool game, though, isn't it? Done from him city. Did someone order a Chinese? Hang on, I'll do a wife test. <laughs> I wouldn't get away with that. That would be a no. I would actually have a Chinese now, though, wouldn't you? Just a small plate, you know. Nothing crazy, not two or three plates. It's a bit re like real life, isn't it? You, you just... You have to have a little look around. Just like that, just, just quickly. Just like, oh, there's no one up there. I wonder if there's anyone behind me. Oh, yeah, oh, there's someone there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, we got her there. Yep. <laughs> this game is on PlayStation 4. Yeah, yeah, it is, isn't it? Yeah, of course it is, yeah. Oh, it's a reference from Gavin and Stacey. I don't watch that, Billy. Yeah, I've never watched that. I wonder what would happen if we... No, she... no, 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 it's fine, it's fine. We can sit where we want now, can't we? Because we've... Uh... There you go, excuse me, madam. <laughs> yeah, it's really busy here. I'm sorry, you just can't get a seat, can you? Yeah, you just can't get a seat. Yep. <laughs> can you imagine walking down here? Ah, oh, you don't mind if I... That's it, just going to climb over. That's it, lovely. What are you doing for the rest of your life? <laughs> Hello, Mystic, how are you? <laughs> Sometimes I like standing by the door. I actually like standing on the train, do you? Yeah, see you later, Daniel. Thank you, mate. Thanks. I feel YouTube is getting smothered with too many of one stuff. Incidentally, I got a chippy. I said, fuck it. I sent my mum out. <laughs> you did a mum test. What do you mean YouTube is getting smothered with too many of one stuff? Explain. What do you mean? What do you mean? What does that mean? Don't tell me you wouldn't, Billy. Don't give me all that, mate. It's Thursday night at half ten. Of course you would. What do I mean do I like I'm do I like I'm older? I'm fifty two years old. I'm basically ancient. Look at me. Now look away. Now look back. <laughs> I don't know what we've got to do for the rest of this scenario. What do you think of the Flying Scotsman? What do you mean, what do I think of it? It's, it's a beautiful bit of machinery, isn't it? Oh, you're watching me on a big 65-inch sky glass. Oh, they do sky glass up to the 65-inch, do they? Woo! And you are a tech god, let, let's be honest. <laughs> I thought she looked quite young to me. Yeah, well, that says more about you, doesn't it? Are you back home yet, Colonel? <laughs> it's 
See you later, mate. Send you, mate. What? Uh, walk over to the side. What? What? Is this even safe? What do you mean walk over to the side in? Oh, you're away until Sunday. Oh, I'll probably see you on the way back. Is this right? That can't be right. Was I meant to get off at the next stop? <laughs> They're all looking at me on there thinking, what is he doing? Why is he doing that? There's trains coming past. This seems so really unlikely. It's an authorised walking route, yeah. Uh, or plane crash investigations or gaming. Well, you just... Surely you get what you want, don't you? You know, with... Um, with the algorithm, I suppose the algorithm can work to work against you a little bit, I suppose, because if you watch a lot of something, YouTube thinks you really like that, so it gives you more. But then the less you watch it, it will learn, because it's an algorithm that actually you've changed your mind, you want something else. So usually if you're getting a lot of something, it's because you like that. The, 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 the answer is stop watching that and you won't get that. Here we go. All right, yeah, let's let's do it. Let's do it, Colonel. Reverse it and oh, oh no, sit down. <laughs> we have a lunatic on the track. <laughs> right, press the start button. Oh, it's like a Aston Martin or something. Look. Hold the compressor uh, for at least one minute. What? Couldn't they get a bloody auto? What? I've got to hold that for one minute. Wow. No wonder they pay drivers so much. What's the requirement? You've got to have a good stiff finger. <laughs> yeah, Scotland Colonel. I don't have the high vis on, no. What do I let go? Does it. Yeah. Had a crazy night with YouTube, now next day everything paranormal, yeah. <laughs> Shane's like, just don't, just, just stop. The best night was when um, <laughs> my missus. Uh, I was just talking shit one night. Uh, we was talking about, uh, I think I was F1, I was playing F1, and someone said about um, nighttime tracks, and I was just fucking about. I went, oh, come on, I don't want to race at night, I'm a fucking playboy, and I'm a playboy, I'm out at night clubbing and all that. And Mrs. just opened the door and went, what are you talking about? <laughs> I was absolutely busted. I was like, no, I'm role playing, I didn't mean it, I'm just messing about. Yeah, Playboy. I'm a fucking Playboy, aren't I? Well, am I still holding this? This is unbelievable. Yeah, she just opened the door slowly and went, What are you talking about? <laughs> she is, Christine. Yeah, she knows me inside out. Oh, it's pissing down. Look. Do I let go of this? That's not a minute yet, is it? Let go now. See, I listen to Daniel. <laughs> Playboy, I, I don't. I'd be out clubbing at night, wouldn't I? And she's just like, "What are you talking about?" Right. Oh, hello. This has been an absolute pleasure tonight. I must say. Hopefully, you've enjoyed enjoyed it as well. How can we see what uh, schedule? That's it. Yeah. Uh, oh, 
we've still got loads to go. Bloody hell. Yeah. So I will make this the, the last one. But this will be the last stream for uh, for a week. About a week plus a weekend, which I don't normally stream anyway, but a week. You can't do gaming until I move all my stuff from mum's to my dad's. Still in the moving process. Oh, all right. Look at that. That's proper driving rain as well, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> what am I going to do next week? I know, Colonel, I know. <laughs> You'll be going into the early hours of all that. Do you reckon? Oh, God. Well, what is the time? It, it's only half ten. That's all right. Yeah, we've got time. You, Chris, what the f... Christopher. What the... I mean, there, there's joking and there's joking, Christopher. What the context there we need to break this down the context there Christopher is just unbelievable especially at Easter what the f <laughs> unbelievable <laughs> I've got a good mind to time him out for that one at this time of year as well honestly You should be, are you ashamed of yourself, Christopher? Yes or no? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> it was like that earlier. <laughs> that was your reply to him. <laughs> Chris thinks that. It was like that earlier. Yes, me too, Shane. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Christopher though we need <laughs> right I'm going to time him out I'm going to give him a time out just, 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 to, just to learn him a little bit put user in time out uh, you can have a one minute time out for that alright there you go and I want you to think about it what you, what you said what you said not me <laughs> Where did that come from, Christopher? That was the, one of the most random sentences. That was one of the most random sentences I've ever said on my chat, actually. <laughs> yep, we timed him out. That was... I'm quite shocked by that. <laughs> I don't think they did the Last Supper request. You're getting it all mixed... You're getting your timelines mixed up. You know... <laughs> that's all you they didn't go oh would you want a steak dinner that's not in the book is it they didn't go oh, well, you know what do you fancy just just pick anything anything you want oh there was none of that <laughs> oh listen to that thunder right let's let's take this up a notch Honestly, <laughs> I think everyone's gone a little bit shocked. 20 people have left the stream for a start. <laughs> Steak dinner with mashed peas and some gravy. Get it all down me, you know. Oh, can I have a bib? You don't need one. <laughs> if I was <laughs> Out of nowhere. <laughs> I don't know why it's funny and now you've just put that in writing, Shane. <laughs> Out of nowhere. <laughs> it's it's getting funnier the more I think about it, but at first I was a little bit shocked. <laughs> Don't ever grant Christopher free wishes. <laughs> it literally come out of nowhere. <laughs> Hello, Jason. How are you? Hello, David. <laughs> Fucking hell. 
you can imagine him around the dinner around the dinner party table <laughs> saying something like that, and there's everyone's just like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> Straight out of nowhere. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> So random. That is the one of the most random things that has ever been said in a stream in seven years. So well done. <laughs> oh god. I don't know how to even finish that. I don't know. <laughs> it's made my day as well. <laughs> if I was ever. What crime are you committing to do that? Oh, if I... What are you saying? If you ever got caught. So what are you doing? What are you doing to get caught? <laughs> Let's get his views on the moon landing. Oh, dear. Oh. That's worn me out, that. Has. <laughs> I saw it. I read it. Should I ignore it? <laughs> I am speeding, actually. Yeah, Yeah, you're right. I'm just enjoying it. Speeding a lot. Yeah, living dangerously, hoping to get caught so I too can be put on the bloody, isn't it? That's it, that's just idle. Unbelievable, though. <laughs> Unbelievable that he even typed that out. He used all the characters from the English dictionary, he typed it all out. What was he thinking halfway through? Oh, he typed out, if I was on the cross, yeah, oh, yeah, he's going to love this. Right. Oh, uh, I would ask for. What would I ask for? <laughs> what would I ask for? Oh, that's what I'd ask for. Yeah. Should I hit return? Should I delete that? Should I reread it? Fuck it. Send that. Send that in front of everyone. <laughs> it was my yeah, taste. <laughs> it was like that earlier. <laughs> oh, I'm not cross of him. It was funny. What's the bet? And he's too embarrassed to come back now. No, I don't, I don't think so. I think it'd be all right. Christopher, can, are you there? <laughs> Have you been resurrected yet? <laughs> it was like that earlier. <laughs> your your message made me laugh, Shane. Straight in there. <laughs> Out of nowhere. Oh, we do have a laugh, though, don't we? How, oh, shit, I'm speeding again. How can we have such a laugh? Just on and on and on, stream after stream. I love it. It's brilliant. You think after seven years, we'd just be sitting here like this? Just like, oh, this is boring. It's not, though, is it? <laughs> so we can get out the tomb. <laughs> oh, he definitely got excited about having his school holiday, didn't he? Yeah, 100%. <laughs> He's got nowhere to go now. And you know, every time he comes in, we're going to bring it up, aren't we? <laughs> it was a pearl of wisdom. It was just so basic, wasn't it? It was just like so. It was just so basic. And like, whoa. Four. <laughs> but it, it, it would only make it better if I had a four in the sentence. <laughs> it could have started with a four, couldn't it? Four. <laughs> oh, God. Brilliant. Christopher, it, that is over a minute. Um, are you still here? <laughs> four. <laughs> You've been here four years. Can we call him Jesus from now on? <laughs> well, you know. I'm not even going there. Oh, nice cut in there. Oh god, that was that really made me laugh. Really made me laugh. That was brilliant. He's been struck. Yeah, struck down. <laughs> I think Christopher left. Christopher, he's still here. <laughs> he's probably like proper taken back at our reaction. He's like, what? What? What's wrong with that? Because everyone gets so desensitised nowadays. He's probably typing that going, oh, this is fucking mild. Oh, what's that? Oh, fancy writing just something a little bit comical. <laughs> Something really mild that I think everyone will appreciate, including Romeo. <laughs> <laughs> That'll have him in stitches. He was right. He was right. <laughs> 
Something for all the family. Given that it's <laughs> given that it's Easter, let's have something for all the family. Now, you know, one for the dads, right? That's fair enough. But everyone can enjoy it. <laughs> Before the nurse sedated him, uh, count backwards from ten. Ten, nine. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God, it's completely thrown me now. You know what will happen. I'll have to start this whole scenario again, all with the travelling bit at the beginning. Oh, it's fine. <laughs> Christopher, are you here? Has he, met? he hasn't messaged, has he? Oh, God. Oh, no, that's another viewer lost, isn't it? That was his... Um, what do they call it? Uh, like, not like the death gurgle, the death, um, the de that was his death rattle, that, that sentence, wasn't it? <laughs> That's what that was, that was his death rattle. <laughs> I'm still laughing about it. I think it was Shane that tipped me over the edge because it's just the way he typed it. Straight out of nowhere. If I was now to a cross. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> How did we get there? I'm just trying to rewind in my mind. We wasn't talking about religion, was we? <laughs> He's genuinely left the stream. Oh, brilliant. That just makes it funnier, I think. <coughs> yeah, we were just talking about Easter. Oh, God. Isn't it funny how words can, like, you know, words are important, aren't they? <laughs> oh, he was, he was stuck straight in the Old Testament, wasn't he? Oh, brilliant. That's made my night, that is. You're not going to beat that tonight, are you? The rest of it is just going to be so boring now. <laughs> yeah, definitely imagine that, yeah. Especially with you, Christine. It was like that earlier. <laughs> The colonel's retiring, yeah. Uh, even Matt Matt couldn't do that. <laughs> Maybe it was miscommunication, yeah. Oh, he probably just meant something just random about cream eggs, yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, that was that's like the roller coaster, you know the bit on the roller coaster where you sort of think, Oh well, that's as bad as it's gonna get or as good as it's gonna get. The rest of it is just like working your way down to the the bit where you get off, that's what this bit of the stream is now. <laughs> We've already done the roller coaster and the loop the loop. <laughs> this is just going to the, the station bit. <laughs> Christopher, are you still here? Christopher? <laughs> no, Derek, nor am I. I should try and make a short out of that quickly tomorrow, shouldn't I? Or is that too much? Is that that sort of naming and shaming a bit mu bit too much? I think it would make a funny short, wouldn't it? Just the way we all cracked up, put some of your text in there as well. Nah, it's a bit much, isn't it? <laughs> it doesn't put that word instead. Oh god, it's only Bance, yeah. I've got nothing against Christopher. It was random AF. I only timed him out for comedy. And he might have got offended by that, but you can't get offended by that after saying that. <laughs> Certainly not on the viewers list. Oh shit. He's probably embarrassed, isn't he? Because just everyone, it just erupted, didn't it? <laughs> 
especially Shane's, straight out of nowhere. <laughs> It was great timing. I don't think there's any timing that would make that okay. God, this is going to take hours, isn't it? So we've got... Uh... Yeah, we've got... This is quite the, the thing, isn't it? We might not even finish this tonight. I think I'll go till about... I'll, I'll go till 11.30. Yeah. As it should arrive. Yeah, that's a good sign, actually, isn't it? If we just went... You'd be like, oh, you're a bit desensitised. Yeah. The same guy that asked earlier about overclocking. Oh, was it? Oh, okay. Maybe it was building up. <laughs> Maybe AC, yeah. He's probably gone to... Oh, I don't know. Whose stream would he go to where that would be acceptable? Oh, God knows. I don't know. Oh, I got a sense of humour though. I wasn't. I wasn't offended. I just. I, well, how can I be offended? I laugh my fucking head off. <laughs> my work is here. My work is done here. Yeah. Oh, I'm definitely not offended. I mean, it was. It was genius. It was just the timing of it was just brilliant. <laughs> wasn't he the one who just become a member earlier? <laughs> he stuck here for a month then, at least. Oh, God. Yeah, he can go to Fabian's stream and say that, yeah. <laughs> I know I'm speeding, but it's fine. You get extra points for that. God, there's so much track here, isn't there? <laughs> yeah, definitely, Daniel. Yeah, I'll go to eleven thirty, but we'll uh, we'll save this scenario anyway. <laughs> Colonel, <laughs> we call him Jimmy now. Next time, refund request. Yeah. There was that thing years ago about people being donated to and then having their charge back. So I don't know if that if that is still a thing you can do. I, don't, I doubt it. But do you remember that years ago? People were going into streams and like donating a grand and then just charging it straight back afterwards. And then making compilations of everyone going, <gasps> someone's just donated a grand <laughs> and then they would just charge it back. <laughs> Terrible. It's Christopher. I'll jump back in. I was trying to have a laugh when you were talking about dating older women. <laughs> I still don't see the connection. Christopher, we laughed, right? What you said was random as fuck. But it made everybody laugh. And I timed you out for comedy, right? You're more than welcome here, Christopher. It was funny as fuck. It was random as fuck. The whole sentence just needed dissecting. But it was funny. We've got a fucking sense of humour here. Yeah? We're not we're not snowflakes. Don't you worry about that. It was it was funny, but it was just like bonkers funny. Like what the fuck? <laughs> there was so much in it that needed talking about. <laughs> it's fine, Christopher. We, fucking hell. We, we've laughed about anything in the stream. It's, it's fine. Nah, no harm meant. You, you, what was you thinking when you was watching us all cracking up? Was you was you happy with yourself? Was you a bit like, oh god? <laughs> yep, yeah, we're gonna stop. Thank you, Daniel. Christopher, it was totally fine. Good night, Douglas. You'll be chuckling to yourself in bed, won't you? It was brilliant, Colonel. Uh, dear Christopher. <laughs> we were coming up with scenarios. Oh, God. Random. I sort of want to read it out again, just to, to, to sort of reiterate, but I'm not going to. I thought it was barred for life. Of course not, Christopher. Of course not.
what sort of people would be we be if we talk of the shit that we do but suddenly we choose to be offended about a certain thing as long as it's not like crossing a line I suppose some people would say you cross the line I suppose but it was just so funny <laughs> it was just so basic and just so scenario based <laughs> Oh, don't give it away, Christopher. Say it was yours. Don't no, don't do that. Don't. Oh, it was him. It was him, Miss. That's what you're doing there, isn't it? <laughs> That's what you're doing. Set the reverser to off. Okay. Yeah, you're, you're saying it was him, Miss. <laughs> it was your reaction that got me cracking up. I couldn't help it, it was too funny. It, it just made no sense. The only sense it made is that we were talking about Easter. I mean, <laughs> that's the only sense it made. I, I need to watch it back to see the build up. I need to, I need to look into your eyes and see the moment you thought yeah, that would be an idea for. That would be great. <laughs> Oh God. But no, we're not offended. Don't you worry about that. Bloody hell. We'd be mad to be offended, wouldn't we? <coughs> yeah, luckily, uh, Romeo. Because that's the sort of thing you'd repeat at seven in the class, isn't it? And then, like you, we can say, I saw it on YouTube, miss. No, you, you're not bad. I timed you out for comedy because it just made it funnier for me. But no, it's fine. <laughs> can he make a short about it? <laughs> Kaz, guess what this bloke said on my stream? No, I think it's one of them things that. I don't think it'll be funny unless unless you're there. Yeah, like if you went in and said that, she'd probably just go, "What? What's he say that for?" And then, yeah, yeah, but it was funny. What? What's funny about that? One of them sort of conversations. <laughs> Hello, Paul. How are you? <laughs> I'm tempted to type it in the chat GT GPT and see what it produces. No, you got to be there. That's not one that you can try and explain. No. Hence the short I'll make tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, he may not use that one. Christopher, just to just to reiterate, no one's angry, right? It's fine. It was funny. Look, you've made my face hurt with laughing. Your job is done. It's totally fine. You've peaked. You're never gonna. You just know that you're never gonna be funnier than that. I suppose that's a good and bad thing, isn't it? You're never gonna be funnier than that again. You're never gonna be able to make a hundred and something people laugh that much. <laughs> <laughs> and you can do a short, just not name. I'll call you. Distifer. Kvidson, I'll just swap the C and the D round. I'll do that. I'll do that. I'll call you um, Chris Davidson. <laughs> uh, uh, Mr. Davidson. <laughs> I hope to. I've only got tomorrow, uh, so I hope to be able to get time on that one. <laughs> I'll just say Joseph Adams. Save a lot of time. Chris Davidson. Yeah, that's the one. <laughs> I'll put a really, really slight blur over your name. Like, really slight. <laughs> All content o belongs to me now. <laughs> Don't be changing into Chris <laughs> You may make an appearance as well. It was, <laughs> it was like that earlier. Oh God, it's going to take me an hour to make this. I need to work on the pacing and do you use music? Do you do like the, the record player? <laughs> <laughs> 
We haven't had many mess-ups tonight, have we? <laughs> well, apart from Christopher. But we haven't had many mess-ups on trains tonight. In fact, none really, which is really <laughs> Jesus Davidson. <laughs> <coughs> Sound effects of a now into a cross. Oh God! <laughs> Have you ever derailed? Yeah, earlier when Christopher put that, I totally derailed. I'll just blame the Joseph and a banana. I'll say the banana did it. Oh, that was good. Uh, laughter's good though, isn't it? You know, if you can have a laugh, then you're winning, aren't you? And as long as you're not laughing, you know, as long as you're not bullying, then it's fine, isn't it? <laughs> the next cream egg advert. Oh, God. <laughs> Imagine doing that. Imagine pitching it, and it does actually become the next advert. Andy, thank you. Welcome back, mate. Thank you. Always Colonel's fault, yes. Yeah, thank you, Andrew. I appreciate that. Or Andy, I should, should say. I think that's what you were playing earlier, wasn't it, Christopher? <laughs> oh, let's play D-Rail Valley. <laughs> no, no snowflakes. God, no. We, we can take a laugh. You have to, don't you? Otherwise... Otherwise, what? People have got to be so careful what they say, haven't they? There's a line, and that might cross the line for some people. Obviously, religious people, of course, would be like a little bit, they'd be a little bit sniffy about that, wouldn't they? But most people, with a sense of humour, will see the humour in it. That's the important bit, isn't it? And <laughs> it was funny. It was just so fucking random. Okay, Dave. That's all right, Andy. I appreciate you coming back, mate. What's happening? Oh, God. Ken. Ken, Ken, Ken. I know there's a time and place. No, no, you're fine. Christopher, you don't have to, you don't have to mention it. You don't have to explain. You don't have to do nothing. It's totally fine. The comments turned off for the next stream, yeah. Yeah, you might want to roll back, Ken. I think it's I think it's worth rolling back. I think it's worth it. Love it, Jason. Yeah, it's been really good. This route is very, very long. Bloody hell. I don't think we're even going to finish it tonight, but it's all good. No, not that. No. No, you'll never... No, that's the thing, Christopher. You will have to accept that that will follow you around forever. But some things you just got to own, aren't you? I think you should own it and just go, yep, yeah, I said that that night and I made everybody laugh. So fucking what? He really did as well. <laughs> Hello, tripe and onions. How are you? Oh, God knows, Ken. I was completely... Did you do the Scottish East Coast line, Jace? Um Yeah, yeah, we did. What, you mean when I did the NC500? Yeah, we went anti-clockwise all the way around. <laughs> For once, it wasn't me. I've seen a few bad reviews. Now, apparently this, this has had quite a few updates and it looked it looks a lot different to what it did when it was released. So, no, the scenery is fantastic. Not necessarily this bit here, but some of the scenery is just mind-blowing as it is in real life up now. I'm not pissed at you, Christopher. I, I, yeah, I'm not going to explain it again, but no, of course I'm not, no. See you later, Kim. You didn't miss anything, Triumph. Oh, I tell you what I am looking forward to in Train Sim is um 
you know when it has the suspension in there which i think is coming in a future update just so it moves a little bit more it sways left and right a little bit I never used to do that, but we're going to get bumps on the, the thing, which would be great. Yeah, and you, Bex, thank you. Is it Matt offended? Yeah, God, no, we'll be all right then. In fact, I think I will leave it at this station. I think we've had such a nice stream that this will be the place to leave it, I think. Is it that bad? <laughs> Got to go and start work on that um, on that short. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to leave it at this station. Thank you very much for coming in, everyone. Oh God, am I actually going to overshoot? See it, say it, fuck it. Yeah, thank you, Ben. Yeah, we'll save it, though. Been fun tonight, though, hasn't it? A whole evening of train sim. It's been awesome. Yeah. Have a lovely week. Um, don't game and enjoy yourself too much without me, if you can help it. I'm always posting shit on Twitter. Link's in the description. If you want to follow me on there, I'll post some stuff of what I'm up to next week. And we can have a chat about gaming and shit there. But other than that... Thank you for tonight. I appreciate all of your time you spend here and I will see you in a week. See you later, everyone.